in the bullet
To tell you, please take care of yourself. Then, with tear stained eyes, I sadly said goodbye as I waved and wished you farewell. Then I think. Hello, friends. Oh, this song. Ah! I don't know why. No, I do know why. It gives me Persona 4 vibes. <laughs> like, obviously, it's not. But I'm just like, I just... There's something about that era of music that I'm just like, this is Persona 4 to me now. <laughs> Hello, how's everyone doing? Welcome, welcome. Like, beautiful, thank you. Um, hello friends. I hope we're doing well today. Um, hello to Noxie, Hispanic, Obliquette, Penguin, Beowulf, Kurtman, Eternal, DZ Horden, um, uh, Tyru, hello, welcome. Good morning from, uh, the UK. Sminch, uh, Kurosu, hello. Angel Sheikah, hello. Con, hello. Last Alley Cat, Bastix. Uh, James, Klee, hello. Um, I've just been starting watching you, Hacker Show. I am, I started with Hunter Hunter and now I am experiencing Tagashi's uh, you, Hacker Show. So I'm doing it maybe the wrong way around, but it's super cool. And I'm glad you uh, like the anime. Uh, hello. Um, Troival, Semper, Drusifer, Beowulf. Uh, hello, Al, Saint Dreamer. Um, it's such good vibes. You Hector is so good. It is an absolute. <laughs> it's great. It's a, it's a great giggle. I have to say, I find them all very funny and wonderful. Um, super quiet. Hell yeah. Let me put on the OSTs. Well, party one. Literally, I'm like six episodes in. Um, I'm very early days. Very early days. How was Winnie time? Oh my God, it was the best. Me and Winnie had such a good time together. I missed her so much. I think I'm gonna see her again this weekend. Um, I loved it. We went on a really nice walk and then uh, I went back to my family home and then we put on the fire cause it was like actually cold enough to like need warmth and played Settlers of Catan and I did so badly. Um, so I just ultimately was like, okay, instead of playing the game, I'm just gonna try screw over everyone else. That was fun. Um, yeah, it was a good time. I've been wanting to watch it years. I can already tell I'm gonna love Yusuke as a protagonist. Yusuke is like a hoot. Like, I don't know how to describe Yusuke. He's just a little like actual menace to society. Like he, he, he's, uh, he's a time. I love him. He's great. He's nuts. Like, like potentially insane. Um, 
Yes. <laughs> Sounds about right. <laughs> Hi, Agfadu. How's it going? Uh, who is your fave? Mine is forever and will be Hiei. It's so cool. Speaking of Hiei, it's really cool to see Togashi's characters in Hunter x Hunter and then like... So like for me, Hiei reminds me of Phaeton from uh, Hunter x Hunter. So I'm just so curious what like Hiei's personality is going to be because all I see is Phaeton, but obviously Hiei came before Phaeton. So I'm like, that's it's just really cool to see. Um, and obviously, uh, K uh, Kumabara? I don't know that name so well yet, but he looks like Knuckle in some ways. It's just so interesting. It's really cool. Um, thank you for the follows. You have a really bad headache. I'm so sorry, Pinky. I hope you feel better. Oh my goodness. I just finished a Yu Hack show earlier this year and loved it. Definitely recommend. Love how you played P5 and watched Hunt Hunter at the same time and now P4 and Yu Hack show. Yo, true! I didn't even realize that. Oh, that's so true. I watched Hunter Hunter for the first time with Persona 5 and now I'm watching Yu Hack show with Persona 4. That's so good. I didn't even realize. Thank you for pointing that out. Yeah, it's a, it's a really good time. Dagashi needs a token edge lord. Hell yeah. I, I love it. My I like, um,. I think my- I've basically been told my favourite will be this character and I already, from knowing them for one episode, I'm like, yeah, this is probably gonna be the case. The, like, redhead guy with the rose, um, Kamara or something? I think he's gonna- <laughs> Karama, Karama. I think he's gonna be my fave. Um, and his voice is incredible. But also his voice, <laughs> his voice is, um, I'm watching the dub and I've only seen like a few episodes of Fruits Basket, but my favorite character was the uncle in Fruits Basket. And I was like, instantly, I was like, that's the uncle from Fruits Basket. That is his voice. That is, that is him. I know because his voice is incredible. I know. Sugar. Yeah, he's the, okay. I. <laughs> I didn't know anything about him and I remember telling Megan like, oh, this guy's my favorite so far. And she was like, yeah, that makes sense. You don't even know yet. And that makes sense. And I was like, oh, oh, okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> it truly checks out. Yay. He's just a good guy. I don't know what happened. I accidentally messed with my graphic settings and now Final Fantasy 14 looks so grainy. Oh no. Maybe he just slapped some defaults on everything. I don't know. I don't know. Um, yeah, the dub is hilarious. I don't know how uh, one of the guys does his voice without his throat just being in constant agony, but uh, it's great. Laura Bailey as well. Um, the worst British accent. The British accent is so bad that it literally took me three episodes to realize which character was doing the British accent. Um, so that's always a good sign. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Rachel. How's it going? There's no better feeling than immediately knowing which character your friend will love and then finding out you're right. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm pretty easy to tell what is very like Hanako character. There's like two main Hanako characters, I feel. Who is doing the accent? Uh, Botan. Oh, Yasuke. <laughs> You skate, you little silly bean. You've got a crush. It's so very, it's so bad. It's the worst accent. <laughs> it's not good. Hey, Flaky. Hi, Farron. How's it going? Hi, Bluebird as well. Hello. Um, yes, I have experienced some more you hack show and play more Final Fantasy 14. So I'm, I'm experiencing some beautiful stories and Persona 4, obviously, naturally. Hi Dom, how you doing? I love Botan's voice. It's 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 British question mark. It's it's I do like the voice to be fair. But it's not British. How far did you get? Uh I'm just about to do Oh my god, wait, I'm gonna show you a screenshot that I took. Oh wait, did I save it? I don't think I saved it. Has AJ got to that moment? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, which one's, I don't know which that moment is. 
he got to chapter 120. <laughs> it was very bad because I, he was like, should I do one or two more chapters? Uh, and I was like, <laughs> we were on episode, we were on chapter 119 or 118. And he was like, should I do one or two more? And I was like, just do a couple more and then we can stop there. <laughs> and then it happened. And then he was like, I had it. <laughs> this is where I'm at in Final Fantasy XIV. Having the time of my absolute life. Um this is it this is this is the experience right now i don't have anything more to say but this is where i'm at um i don't actually know what the quest is called honestly i need like something a little spicy to start happening soon in the quest line but i was very happy at this so i took many screenshots I started playing Persona 4 going on Steam, so I can catch up and watch streams live. I've been wanting to play P4 for years anyways. I'm not quite caught up to you yet. Chia, just got to Ooh! Oh my gosh, you're really close though. I'm like, so I've been uh, so slow in playing. So you are like, you're almost there. Um, but that's really cool. And then we can like play together and keep up with each other. That's so cool. Hi, Crimson. How's it going? Uh, I know. I need more rabbit pies. There are so many that moments. The whole. You might have to tell me on Discord. Because <laughs> I... <laughs> I think I know what you mean. I'm not sure. We're, we're on episode, uh, chapter 120 something. 123? Um, like a book club? It is like a book club. That would be great. That would be so good. Yeah, definitely. Um, hi, Winfra. How's it going? Every JJ can arc is that moment. Oh my God. I saw like the leaks of the recent chapter and my brain is just like... I was taking a break because I didn't like the current JJK arc that much. And now I'm like, oh, I have been dragged back. I'm here. Hello. I'll catch up, I guess. <sighs> Hi, Just Max. How's it going? Uh, underwater adventure. It's so beautiful. I love the underwater music. I added so much of the OST to my playlist, so it might come on. See, oh, I opened the website and I didn't turn it on. Thank you. Thank you so much, Hailing. Just binge read it. The binge read will be good since you have a lot of charges to go through. Yeah, maybe. I just don't like the current arc that much. I like moments. Like some moments are actually some of my favorite bits in the series, but like overall the story and like. What's going on? Oh, point of view, yes. Yes, we are on front page. Um, but just heads up, I don't tend to like knowing exactly how many people are watching because it like freaks me out a little bit. Um, but we're on the front page of Twitch. Uh, hi, Anna. How's it going? Hey, welcome to chat. Um, I put it in the manga section. Also, sorry if I'm sniffly. I had ramen. All right. No, we're, that's, that'll be uh, tomorrow night. We'll experience that. <laughs> I, I'm not ready. I thought that's what you meant, but no, not yet. Soon. Uh, Hannah Famous? No, 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 no. I find it so uninteresting. Me too, but the leaks. I don't know if you've seen the leaks. I don't know if you're interested in the leaks. The leaks have drawn me back very suddenly and very quickly. So I may catch up. I may catch up. You know what I have to do? So like all of the autumn uh, anime is starting and I have never seen Mob Psycho and I really don't want to be spoiled. So I'm somehow going to have to consume all of Mob Psycho season one and two so quickly before it starts season three. And I need to understand Reagan as a being. 
on page eight, so more friends that can join the totally awesome Discord that is totally not weird, but completely normal. <laughs> I like how immediately under that is no more Ampreg, we're on front page. <laughs> the leaks, they are beautiful super materials. Uh, the leaks are the Jujutsu Kaisen leaks for this week's chapter. I'm screwing for my hair because I am in season six. Um, I don't know anything about My Hero Academia, but everything I know, I wish I didn't. <laughs> everything I see about the latest chapters, I'm just like... <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> what is happening? Uh, P4G is an amazing game. I hope you enjoy it as much as I did. Thank you! I'm loving it so far. That is a valid reaction. I don't, like, I thought, like, my heroes meant to be pretty damn good, but, and I'm sure it is, but still, <laughs> there are decisions being made, you know? How far have you gone? We're, like, right at the very beginning. Um, we've saved, like, we've done the, the first dungeon, but we're not, I haven't seen the, like, it's still raining. Yukiko is not chatting. She's having a nap. She's sleeping. Um, hell yeah, Adam. That's really cool. I hope you have a lot of fun. Aren't that long, so you'll be able to breeze through them pretty easily. Nice. Uh, Bluebud? I am the exact same. I'm sure that might change. Like, I... I, I am under no... Uh, like, obviously, please don't tell me what happens, but I know that there are probably very valid reasons people don't like Teddy. But as of right now, Teddy is fine. Like, he's had, like, one kind of weird thing, but, like, Teddy's just fine. Like, Teddy's just cool. I'm, I'm completely vibing with Teddy. Um, he's a little freaky little freak, and that's fun. Uh, holy golden- holy- <laughs> Hoi, we'll go with Hoi. Hoi, Golden Tokon. How you doing, Tukon? Uh, I love Teddy. Teddy is Teddy. It's true. Like, I don't know what it was, but when they, like, removed his head and there was nothing there, that just made me at ease. I was just like, yeah. I like that he's just, like, this empty Teddy. I, I'm completely down with that. I don't know why. I was just happy and content that he wasn't like a real thing. <laughs> like he's just literally empty. And I like that, I guess. <laughs> Whereas like Morgana had the whole like, I'm not a cat. I'm just like, Teddy is just Teddy. Head empty, literally. And he makes glasses. That's fun, I guess. He's got a hobby. <laughs> Last night I may or may not have cried twice at the end of Final Fantasy XV, first while playing it myself, then watching your VOD. <laughs> Aww, I hope you enjoyed the journey. Oh, I know you enjoyed it. I'm glad you enjoyed it. State much? Place is smack dab in the heart of Tokyo. Thank you, Car Siegel. Thank you for the prime. Thank you for the seven months of support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome back. Um, I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, I'm so glad you rated Final Fantasy XV so high because Final Fantasy XV for me is like so underrated and I think, even though there are a lot of issues, I think it's like such a good game that does friendship so well. Like, I think it does friendship the best out of any game I've played um, and showcases friendship the best. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. I very much recognize Sam Regal's voice. <laughs> Um, and I, I've watched a lot of Crit Roll. Yes. Hi, Recluse. How's it going? Hi, Charles. What's up? It will probably stay my favorite Final Fantasy. So based, Eternal. So based. Hi, CB. Final Fantasy 15 might have more cons than pros for me, but those pros are really good. Yeah, literally, like, for me, the friendship alone is, like, pro enough that the game is good. Like, yeah. I vibe with Teddy. He's just a weird round TV bear and I can respect that. Exactly. I'm, I'm, the, I'm the exact same. I'm just like, yeah, he's just a little man doing his old stuff. 
What a w weird little man he is. <laughs> Uh, it's always seemed like people generally view him more positively than Morgana. Interesting. It was, I don't know, so I obviously don't read anything on like Twitter because I don't want to be spoiled. So all of my views on like what the <laughs> what the people think are from Twitch chat. And it, at least, obviously it was biased because I was playing Persona 5, but it definitely seemed like Morgana was preferred to Teddy. Um, but a lot of the arguments came from um, one isn't as bad as the other. Like, Morgana is less bad than Teddy, whereas I read that as they're both bad. <laughs> so I'm curious what direction it ends up going in, you know? Uh, Ubis, hello! What exact, when exactly is the final fantasy? I got an offer to work with Scarring and I think the whole company's gone downhill. There is never a final. The Final Fantasy is the the one you you never finish. Um, I watched a video on YouTube and your emotions on Kingdom Hearts is so amazing. Thank you. I have issues with both mascot characters. That's very fair. That's very fair. Neither can hold a candle to the P3 mascot. Ugh, I can't wait to experience P3 mascot one day. Are they good? Uh, I personally, Persona 5 is one of my favorite games ever. If you like a very long emotional journey, you'll enjoy Persona 5. Um, you guys are the best. Yeah, like I have issues with the plot of Final Fantasy 15, but I think basically the main four are done so well and so incredibly that even with like a pretty damn poor plot, like you are like you can just be so attached to them but everything hits how it should hit with them. Hi Riz, how's it going? Favorite JRPGs of all time, hell yeah. Hi Swift is night, had a rough day at work and I'm immediately in a better mood. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Um, I hope you feel better. I hope we can distract from the bad vibes and make them good vibes. Seven is overrated, IMO. Seven's my favorite, sorry. <laughs> Seven Remake specifically is my favorite, but it was also the one that introduced me to Final Fantasy and JRPGs. Um, I did some of 10 too, but I've never finished it. Cozy murder vibes. I think Teddy has a more charming personality though. That's just me. Very fair. Very fair. I find Teddy also more like charming in the first, like first uh, meeting, but I like actively didn't like Morgana at first, so. Yeah. Um, although speaking of all this, uh, I was thinking I could like actually try and do my first proper ranking of uh, Persona 4 characters. Um, Cause sadly Pompous Customer and Haru aren't real characters and nor is the funky music. Um, so I was thinking we could do like a proper one. Um, this ranking is perfect. <laughs> well, I'll just keep this one. Um, Haru does need to be present to be the best. <laughs> she is just the best. Lists, I love lists, I love ranking. I love ordering them. That's why every game we played this year has a, <laughs> has a ranking. <laughs> okay, I don't know how many characters there are actually. Let's just figure it out. And if I forget anyone, you let me know. Uh, all the teachers at the school are at the bottom. <laughs> uh, number one is Yosuke so far for me personally. He's just a cool dude. He's just a silly little boy. He's just a little fool. <laughs> Why don't you go ahead and put adults? Because I like the adults. I like the adults. They're, I like uh, Dejima a lot. Which one? Dejima! I like Dejima and Adachi. I like them both. They're cool. I mean, Adachi's a little questionable. <laughs> but, but in a fun way. In like a way of 
I'll slap him if I can. <laughs> but he's just a little dummy. He's just a little dummy boy. Adonji puked, so I hate him. How dare he puke when he see a dead body? Disgusting. Get over it. Uh, Nanako is number two. Nanako is my... We will protect Nanako forever. Hi Soda, how's it going? Um, then it's probably Dejima actually. Because Dejima to me is very interesting. I'm very like, yes, give me more Dejima. I would wish to know more about him, please. Pissy trash number one. <laughs> yes. Uh, I didn't see the Fire Emblem rankings. No, I love Lawrence. Lawrence I'm gonna recruit next time. I already know the four characters I'm recruiting next playthrough. I can give you my Fire Emblem ranking. It's all, oh, it's a mess. It's a mess. It's a disaster. But I like Lawrence. I'm recruiting Lawrence next time. Um. Um. That's a huge ranking. Fire Emblem has many characters. Felix, I read Felix trick last night. They just, I just threw up. I just died. I just was in so much agony. Um, I'm gonna recruit. Sorry, just for the fire emblems. When I do Edelgard's route, I'm gonna recruit Felix, Ash, Marianne, and Lawrence. I've decided. I want the angst of Felix versus Dimitri. I just want it because I'm a horrible human and I just want them. I just Dimitri and Felix. Just my brain is wow, wow. Wow. Um. Wow. It was a Felix and Dimitri fic. It was awful. It was like Dimitri thinking that Felix was Glenn and like Felix is like into Dimitri, but Dimitri thinks Felix is Glenn and he's like in bad times. And it was just like, oh my God, it was horrible. It was so horrible. It was really good. Uh, written very well. Do you ever read happy fanfic? Hold on. Looking at my bookmarks real quick. Hold on. Tags. Angst and pining are two of my highest tags on my, uh, on my bookmark list, so we're just gonna go with no and <laughs> leave it there. <laughs> um, do you actively filter? No, I don't actually. I tend to only read like, I don't know, I'm quite picky, but basically what I'll do is I'll go through, so I'll find the like uh, relationship I want and then I'll search usually by like kudos. Um, I'll search by kudos like when I'm first exploring the tag. Then I like open up so many fix in new tab in new tabs. Thank you. <gasps> Thank you so much. The fee vibes while working. Many thanks to you and Chad for the laughs and vibes. Excited to see my previous eagles next. Oh my gosh, I love the eagle. I can't wait. Eight oh god, my god. Thank you so much, Kerbex. Thank you for the £9.23. That's so kind of you. Thank you so much. I'm whacking the mic. Thank you. That's really, really kind. Um, yes, I don't know if you if you heard it, but I was just saying about how I've already decided who I'm going to recruit for the for Eagle Gods. Um, I can't wait to be an eagle. Truly. That's so good. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I'll like open so many fix up in new tabs. And then I'll pretty much go by like the first paragraph as to whether I'll like it or not. Like I'll read the first few lines and then I'll be like, nope, or yes. And that's how I, that's how I go with it. Um, who are there, who am I thinking of? Adachi, I guess? Is there any other characters? Oh my God, bull, bo bull, bull boys, lads, kings, yes. Um, I see nothing else. No, I was, uh, cause me and AJ have been reading Jujutsu Kaisen, so I was showing him the volumes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't cheat while it's Joker now, but Joker's there. 
Um, oh, the main character. He doesn't really have a personality yet. Yeah. Uh, I do like anime, yes. Teddy! Oh my god. Sorry, Teddy. Teddy, you're vibing. Oh, jeez. Teddy's fine. Teddy can go here. He's just chill. He's just fine. He's cool. Uh, oh, and Yumi. I need... Uh, Yumi can go here. Yumi! I don't know if we made out with Yumi. I don't really know what happened there, but I just am like, oh, uh, Ed's fine. Um... The Val... Oh! Marie and Margaret? I'm not really sold on either of them right now, to be honest. Hmm. Where do we put them? Probably here, to be honest. I like Margaret most. Then you go. Then Marie. I just really, really am desperate that Marie is not like the most stereotypical Sundry character in the whole world. I'm like, fingers crossed. Um. Yes, I really want to watch the anime. I've actually heard it's a really good Persona anime, so don't worry. That is the plan. Hey Ezra, what's up? Is he your dad? He did say he gives birth to Personas. I love this eagle voice because, um, <laughs> because it's Hanuman from Fire Emblem. <laughs> so I'm just like, yeah, he's cool. He's a fun guy. He's a little dude. I have watched Jujutsu Kaisen, yes. I have all of the manga here. In ratings jail, I can't wait. I watched some of the Persona 5 anime, and then I'm not gonna lie, um, I, I, I said, I, I, we, I, I was watching with Lee, my friend, and then we were like, let's stop watching. <laughs> it's not the best of animes that's ever existed. It's a time. It's a, it's a time. It's an anime. Just say it was bad. Oh no, I know, it's, I was gonna watch. I mean, watch it, like you might enjoy it. There's some funny moments. It's, it's an anime. It's an anime. Uh, there are some really like good moments. Like I really like moments where Ryuji is like, it's weird. Cause like Joker is also kind of just like a, <laughs> he makes some like joke. I think they're jokes. I don't really know. And I'm like, what? It's kind of mean but basically the main issue i think with the persona 5 anime is that it tries to showcase the games like like it tells you how to like execute personas and stuff and i'm like we don't need to know that like i don't think with the limited time we already have we need to know the game mechanics in the anime um so it's a little funky also it's really really wild because um oh the op and ed are great uh, I will say that. I often play them in the starting music. Um, but the... So all of the like side characters and like random bystanders are played by the main actors. I think maybe like budget reasons or whatever. So it is weird because you'll hear like Keith Silverstein who plays Shido introduce Akechi like as a reporter. And you're like, that's Keith Sil- that's Shido saying welcome to catch it's it's just it's it's weird <laughs> where are we up to um i've just defeated the first dungeon but i haven't like seen the fallout from it it's still raining hopefully that's vague enough um hopefully don't worry i never um <laughs> I always have an open mind when I go into anything new, so I will not judge. Um, 66, thank you so much for the six months. Oh my gosh, 666, six, six. nice. Thank you so much. I hope you're doing well. Um, thank you. 
I hope you're doing really good today. Um, lol. Yes, I think the voices are just a little different, you know? Um, I completely get what you mean, but like in that P5 anime, it's like the same voice. Like it's not even, like you'll have Morgana talking as the as Morgana, and then Morgana is serving you in the restaurant, but it's still Morgana's voice. Like it's and it's like this next scene. It's it's yes. Um, thank you so much, uh, Salicious, for the uh, brand new sub. That's really really kind. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoy the emotes. Uh, I hope you enjoy it here. Thank you so much for the support. Thank you. Um, thank you, thank you. And now that we're talking about Persona 4 a lot, I just really want to play Persona 4. Let's, shall we play some Persona 4? Have your pipe Persona 4? <laughs> Sorry, I just saw that message before I got deleted and I was like, <laughs> Hello? I'm sorry? What? Let's play some Persona. Persona! Um, God, this song is so good. Front page is wonderful. It's delightful. Persona. Uh, we go here. We wait for the game to load. I pause the music. Boom. And now we get funky intro time. Hell yeah. Kisona. Yes. Is the See you, Blue Bud. Have a good one. Diamond. It's good enough to be diamond. It's just trash, trash boy instead of diamond boys. <laughs> yes. I love this intro because I don't ever want to look at it close enough to think anything, so I'm just like vibing and not properly watching. I love bit rates. Wow. <gasps> nice. Good job. Okay. Does this next piece of music remind anyone of Kingdom Hearts? Like, I have been going insane about this for a very long time. In. I'm just like, that's Kingdom Hearts! I'm playing Kingdom Hearts! <laughs> uh. <sighs> See, I think because I play Kingdom Hearts first, I'm like, that's Kingdom Hearts. Daily Persona. <laughs> I am playing Kingdom Hearts right now. Sora! How's it going? Hi, Nanako! <gasps> nice. Are we going out? I can watch the house. Oh, yes, we're abandoning you another day. <laughs> All right, what do we do? Because it's still raining. So, um. There is no music. There is no fun allowed. Um. But we do have a funky umbrella. I can't believe Persona 4 invented the Kingdom Hearts. Wild. TBH. I forgot about the silence. Yeah, we have to just sit with our own thoughts now, I guess. Hello. 
You know about the Midnight Channel? Yeah, I do. Find your soulmate, my king. Um, that submenu lady, I will not talk to her again. I will not make this mistake for the fifth time. The real horror game. Yo, actually, I have a question. Uh, not for, not because it's October soon or anything like that or anything at all. Don't, not because I was somewhat inspired by this game or anything. Is there any way to play Silent Hill? Is there a good way to play Silent Hill now in this current day and age in the I don't know we can't have a stream without talking the sub menu lady no um Silent Hill 3 is on PC with mods with black oh yes absolutely with a blanket silent hand stream yes no legally oh, okay okay I see I see Thank you, Penguin. Hey, are you used to this place yet? It's so different from the city, I bet it's hard. Not only that, but Dejima's sons is a male-run household. Must be tough. If you ever have trouble with cooking or anything, you come to my place. You know Sozai, Sozai Daigaku, right? I don't. That's okay, I know you're new here. It's on the north side of the shopping district near the bulletin board. You should try out the grilled steak croquette. Oh, I have been there. Sorry. I know I'm changing the subject, but it looks like it's going to rain until tomorrow. My wife seemed pretty happy about it. The wife of kind man is the murderer. I have figured it out. No one's happy about the rain because it means the fog. But this person understands the fog. So they are the murderer. Your wife is a murderer, sir. I've solved the crime. I can't believe it was right under our noses the whole time. Obviously tough having to actually do things for himself. <laughs> That's pretty tough, not having a woman to cook for him. Oh my god. Welcome, welcome. Uh, I can give you a return daikon. Yeah, sure. I don't know what that is. Yeah, bye. That's it for today. Oh, cheers. Oh, aren't you the boy who moved into, to, into Dojima-san's place? Of course I know about you, we're neighbors after all. Since you and Nanako chan are growing children, I worry that Dojima-san doesn't take care of you. Eat your veggies, okay? Thank you. Hi, Pachi! Same! Like I was just about to say, I love the rainy vibes, and then I love the... Like, one of my favorite bits is just that, like, everyone knows each other. So, like, that woman just then being like, oh, of course I know who you are. We're neighbors. I love that. I love that everyone knows everything about each other, but there's a freaking murderer and no one knows who the murderer is. And it's, I love that stuff. I love it. It's good. It's good. I have boob yen. Wow. Big Brain Hannah solved the game so fast. You had it here first, Fox, so Apollo has spoken. <laughs> uh, is this your store? Hee ho! I'll have um a good steak crack. I like the combination of diced meat and potato. Yes. Thank you. Have you seen this? <laughs> Nothing like a small town serial murder to kick off the morning. Yes, it's such good vibes to wake up with. I love it when it's so cozy and murderous. It's really fun. Um, Dice me, murderer? <gasps> what if that lady... Yeah, because his wife. Didn't he say his wife on the thing? That's a complete reading human. Oh my god. Can you believe... It got really dark really quick in this game. Apollo holding the sniper rifle. <laughs> Ready to take me out at any second. Uh, okay, we need to go somewhere to level. I remember um, there was that uh, shop I could go to, the diner place. Ooh. Oh. Oh my god, we can get a haircut? The shop is closed. Oh. Anyway, I was gonna say we could go do the Big Bang Challenge. I mean, definitely not that. It's ramen. 
ramen time. Yes, it's so expensive, but it's fine. Uh, thank you, Lord. It's been, we just started, but it's very fun. Fates are awakening? Maybe. I'm not sure. I've heard they're not as great, but I know some people still like really love them, but they're just like, yeah, it shows its age or whatever. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. You still can't see the rice. You begin to suspect that your bowl is a portal to the meat dimension. The amount of meat contained within this bowl is truly staggering. In order to finish this bowl, you must have understanding of your limits, knowledge to control your pace, courage to face this unrelenting tide of beef, and the diligence to persevere against this colossal challenge. You are unable to finish your meal. It's okay, I couldn't finish my ramen today either. Um... Awakening saved the franchise, but Blazing Claw is definitely my most replay game. Damn. Love going to the meat dimension. <laughs> I've been catching up on your Persona 5 videos on YouTube and I love them. Thank you, Bruno. That's I see. Thank you all so much. Um, yes, I've been editing a lot of Persona 5 over the last two days and I didn't realize quite how much I cried at the end of that game, but well. Wow. Thank you for the follow. Consume your case soul. I put the soul into the bowl. Too bad. At the end already. I'm at the end of um, Persona 5, but not royal stuff yet. I just fully edited Engine Room. That was. Due to the weekend rainfall, clear skies seem unlikely in the area. The time. Hi, Brandy. What's up? A thick fog is expected to set in tonight and remain until tomorrow morning, with heaviest concentration in the Inaba area. Anyone planning to go out tonight should take care. Now for our hourly weather breakdown. More fog, huh? There's been a lot of that lately. Hopefully it's not a sign of more trouble. Hopefully, Dejima. Uh-uh-uh. What did I say about changing the channel without asking? Have a great day, even during Golden Week, at your local Juness. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day's great at your Juness. Everybody ready? Every day's great at your Juness. They're going to be open during Golden Week. <laughs> I heard. Do you want to go somewhere during the long holiday? Oh. <laughs> we can go. Uh, no, the Chima don't promise this because I know you're gonna let her down. Don't do it. How about it? Got any plans yet? No. Don't set us up for failure, the Chima. I don't have any plans, so I'm absolutely willing to go. Together! Yeah! Junus, 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 Junus! <laughs> Let's go to Costco! You sure you want to go to Juness? We can go there anytime. Come on, girl. Time for bed. Aww. Alright. Every day's great at your Juness. I have so many emotions! Nanako seems very excited about the family outing. I'm excited too, Nanako. I really hope nothing bad happens so Dejima cancels. Why am I crying over something that hasn't happened? I'm not attached to this family already. It's fine. Thank you for the follow. Juness, huh? She's satisfied to go somewhere that's so close. Well, I'm not gonna force you, but if you don't have any plans, try to keep it in mind. I'll come. What the hell? Of course. Of course I will. Thank you for the follows. Um, you being attacked me? Having emotions and feelings? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Never. It's midnight. It's so foggy, holy moly. It is just gray. Mm. 
no one is appearing on the Midnight Channel. Since Yukiko has been rescued, it seems the killer was thwarted this time. Hmm, seems that way, huh? Huh. Meanwhile, at the fog shrouded shopping district. No! The voice says dot 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 dot. What if they just kill someone else because we saved Yukiko? Oh, good morning. Thank you for the follow. Piano time! Feeling any better? Yeah, I'll be coming to school again, so that'll be nice. Yeah! I caused everyone some real trouble. Not at all. I'm sorry. It wasn't your fault you almost got murdered. Oh, sorry isn't quite right. What I mean to say is... Thank you. Yukiko seems more cheerful than before. My mother's back to work already. The maids are being really supportive. And I think things are going even smoother than before. Hell yeah. I wonder if I was trying too hard. You're a child. I may have been too caught up in the idea that I had to do everything myself. Yes. Ever since the incident, I feel like I can think about these things more calmly. I... Oh. Still kind of embarrassing. <laughs> Her face glowed so red, I thought that was an issue, but she's just blushing. <laughs> you guys saw everything, even the things I didn't want to admit. Don't worry about it, that's only one part of you. You've already changed, everyone's like that. Mm. That's only one part of you. I'd like to believe that. Yukiko! Mm, the ladies! Oh, it's TA! Well, I'll talk to you later. Okay. You hang out with TA. You go out. Yukiko has come back as energetic as ever. It's <laughs> very relaxed. It's a good thing you were able to save her. It sure is. It's a great thing. Huh? Yukiko-san, Yukiko-san is back. That's good. I'm glad the only cutie in the clock. What is wrong with the teachers in this school? He looks normal. For once, there was a normal looking teacher and he's just a creep. Truly Thank you for the 300 bitties! Thank you so much for the bits. The only cutie in the class is was able to return, wouldn't you guys agree? Oops! I mean all of you are cute. No, really. Uh, please don't tell your parent. Okay, I'm gonna kill Mr. Yamada. As I'm personally gonna get sucked into my TV and I'm gonna kill him. Aha! Anyway, I have an interesting topic for you today. Close your books and take a look at the handout. Sounds like a good time to pick on the city boy. Sure. What do you want, you little bitch? Sorry. Um, what is the greatest canyon in the solar system? What? I will say the Persona 4 questions are so much harder than the Persona 5 ones. Yeah, he's Shawake Crime Boy. Distant relative of Sariku Crime Boy. What? I don't have a single clue. I'm gonna go with this one because it doesn't have Canyon in the name. Well, you really are from the city. Well, I guess that doesn't have anything to do with it. <laughs> Did I get it right or wrong? I think I got it right. The largest mountain? 
Both of the highest mountain and the greatest canyon are on Mars. Isn't that useful information? No. Since you got me started on canyons, I'm gonna cover some material on their characteristics. They're kind of canyony. <gasps> Sorry to keep you waiting. The sub was yours, right, Chie? Thanks! Oh, that smells so good! These instant noodles are just the thing to help me through club. How much longer do I have to wait on this? <laughs> just go for it, Queen. It's a few minutes. Just go for it. So why are we here? Oh yeah, we were gonna ask Yukiko what happened. Yukiko-san, I hate to bring up stuff you'd rather not think about, but I need to ask you again. Did you recall anything about when you got kidnapped? No. I thought I might remember something if I let it sit for a while, but as time passes, it only gets hazier. I think the doorbell rang at the entrance, and someone called for me. But when I woke up after that, I was already in the castle. I'm sorry. Hmm. No need to apologize. Thank you, Chie. But does this mean her Face. visitor is the culprit? I don't know. If it's true, then that's one daring criminal. What kind of killer would ring the doorbell? The police are probably looking for witnesses, but I don't think we can expect much from them. <laughs> As if the culprit wore bright yellow clothes at the scene of the crime. I wonder why whoever it is would do stuff like this. We won't know until we confront them ourselves. But we can be sure of one thing. It's no coincidence that people keep ending up in that place. Someone on our side is definitely kidnapping them and throwing them into the TV. It's murder, all right. Oh yeah, we never told you. This guy and me are gonna catch the culprit ourselves. <laughs> the police are out of their league on this case, but we got personas. Yosuke, honey. <laughs> Never fear, we'll get him. Us lads. We'll get him. Uh, can you lend us a hand? Yeah, we'll all just be one big crew. Huh? Um. I'm helping out too! Yeah! I can't believe someone would throw people into a place like that. I'm gonna sock whoever's doing this. <laughs> Chie. <laughs> It's like Chie again. They know she's gonna invite herself. <laughs> they don't need to hand out an invitation. Let me help too. Of course. I want to know why this is happening. Especially if someone hates me so much they want to kill me. I don't want to run away from myself anymore. Don't worry. I don't think it's you specifically they hate. I mean, so far it's just oh, women. And let's all so. run together and catch this asshole. Agreed. You could go join the group. She'll definitely be a strong asset in solving the case. Friendship. We're so fools. Wow, look at us go. Your power to create personas of the full arcana has grown. But how are we going to find them? We don't have a single lead yet. I'm the third one to be targeted so far, but I have a feeling this isn't the end of it. If we had an idea of who might be targeted next, wouldn't we have an advantage over the killer? So we'll outsmart them, huh? Yeah, that might work. Okay, so let's see if we can figure out what ties the victims together. First, there was that announcer, Mayumi Yamano. Mm -hmm. Second, was Saki Konishi, senpai. Was Yukiko Amagi. Yo, the line read of that senpai was the best read of a senpai I've ever had. What the hell? Hi, Orange. How you doing? How's it going? I need to give this game a go again. It's I'm really into it so far. Um, thank you for the follows as well. Welcome. So they're all women. But it was interesting because like with Mayumi, I could definitely see it as like the murderer's intent is like punishing sinner type of thing, like very much that sort of vibe. 
And then with Saki, I was like, oh, it's just because like she knew too much. Like she was on the on the TV, etc. So far, I guess every single woman has been on TV. Like Mayumi was on the news because of the affair, Saki was on the news because of the murder, and Yukiko was on the news because Mayumi was staying at the inn. So they've all been on the news. Yo, I want to order a, a cork board and some red string and just... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what do they all have in common? They all live in Inaba, they're all female, nothing at all. Well, they're all female. It's one. Bingo. How dare he target females! Now that's unforgivable. The culprit's gotta be some kind of perv. <laughs> Hell yeah, she ate! <laughs> Murder more men! <laughs> also, what about this? The second and third victims had some sort of connection to the first one. <laughs> um, yes, they did. Hey, that's right! Yukiko and Saki-senpai both had connections to that announcer! Announcer? That's true. Then, does that mean females connected in some way to Miss Yamano's case are being targeted? I think that's a safe assumption for now. People have ruined the same females, honestly. Like, whenever it's said like this, it comes across like the most, like, incel type vibes. And I'm like, what? But I know this game is old and it's probably translation as well. So it's just like... You can just say women. <laughs> you can say that. There's another angle we can take, too. If another person disappears... You think they'd be on that midnight channel? That happened right before Yukiko was kidnapped, too. Yeah, it's hard to tell who at first, but what's important is it's happened before the victims disappeared. Kind of like a ransom note. We still don't know why that happens, <clears throat> but we'll have to rely on it for now. The next time it rains. It seems that the Midnight Channel is your only means of predicting who will be kidnapped next. You must remember to watch it on the next rainy night. By the way, aren't those done by now? Next rainy night. Got it. Locked in. Whoa, that's right! Chow time! Done with murder talk. That was a very satisfying noise. Hey, could I try just a little bit of that? Just one tiny bite? Hands up the soba, pal! Go get your own if you want some! Jay. Okay, just one bite. Got oh, sorry, Jay. Nom, 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 nom. The delicious aroma from the udon bowl is drifting your way. Do you Ow, want to try some? my tummy. I'm so hungry. I'd love to try a bite. So good! The aroma, the flavor, and the texture all combined. This is perfect! It's too delicious to stop eating. You guys... Ah! What the hell are you doing?! I think men should be murdered. <laughs> you ate everything! My fried tofu? No! <laughs> Hope you guys understand what this means. Kill him, Chair. Wait, 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 stop! I'm sorry! Kill him. I'll buy you steak. It'll be on me. Oh, she does love steak. You hear me? The very best. She does love steak. Steak? My tofu. <laughs> I'll buy you tofu. Kiko, there's steak in it for us now. We can eat instant noodles anytime we want, right? When do we get steak? If you had a steak, it's steak. Steak. Well, as long as it isn't too fatty. Okay, we've reached the verdict. You are hereby sentenced to buying a steak. What wouldn't be too fatty? Filet? Ooh, filet sounds nice and expensive. Filet, 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 filet mignon. <laughs> Hey, you got a pony up to you. You're just as much to blame. <laughs> I want 
about to be in a lot. <laughs> Man, talk about great timing. Philippe, 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 y'all. Steak today. Oh, oh my god, food court steak, let's go. We're doing our part to spread this town's specialty dish. Plus, we've already got an excellent grill. That's just a yakisoba griddle. Oh well, steak is steak. It's far from a filet steak, though. Yukiko, are you okay with this? It's not too heavy for you? Chie just making sure that, 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 that all of the food is okay for Yukiko. And just being like, is Yukiko happy? Because then I'm happy. I'm definitely not in love with her. I don't know what you mean. We're definitely not in together. What's, what? I'll eat it. I'm still <sighs> So back on topic. I wonder what kind of person the culprit is. If you focus just on the announcer's case, it seems like a revenge thing. Yeah, that was her that's exactly what I said. Oh, no, 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 that's not what I meant. No, 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 no. I, I, no, that's fine. But Mizuzu Hiragi had a solid alibi, didn't she? And it seemed like she was already separated from her husband. Really? You know an awful lot about this. <laughs> you know an awful lot about murder, Chie. Okay, what about the second case? Saki-senpai. She found the announcer's body. Thank you for the hydrate. Assuming the same person killed them both, then why target senpai? She knew too much. She might have seen something. On the news. It was to shut her up. Yeah, I think so too. Maybe she found a clue or something about the culprit. But the killer just threw the announcer into a TV, right? I don't think he would have left evidence the police, much less a high school student, would catch. Yeah, exactly. Man, I thought the countryside... A dachi! But it's proving to be a lot more exciting than I thought. The boy, the man, the myth, the tell, all legend. He will give us every police secret there is. Oh, they updated the menu. Huh? Isn't he that detective? Hey, Adachi! Hey, you were at Dojima-san's. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, wait. Hey, this is great timing after all. You're not what? Dojima-san said that he'll be leaving work on schedule tonight. Could you pass that on to Nanaka-chan? Fuck yeah! Yo, I'm Adachi, Dojima-san's gopher. Uh, I mean, his partner. Are you this busy every day? Huh? Oh, well, the public seems to be getting a charge out of these cases. We can't leave it at that. Sorry to butt in, but could it be that the killer targeted Saki-senpai in order to silence her? Um, you sure get to the heart of the matter. Yes. Anna? <laughs> is there a reason Tajima is always late home? Is he falling in love with Adachi? Is there a whole story here too? Of course, we're also thinking along those lines. She was killed right after the announcer's body was found. If the killer was trying to silence her, there might have been something at the scene only she would have understood. Mm. Which would mean that the culprit may be someone close to Miss Konishi. Nothing like that points to Misuzu Hiragi, so... Yeah. Oh, I might have stumbled across something here. Adachi, you're so smart! Wait, are you listening to all that? Crap, me and my big mouth. <laughs> Don't tell anyone I said any of that, or Dojima-san will flay me alive. <laughs> <clears throat> Relax, kids. The police are on the job. See ya. You are a little goofball. You were right, Yosuke. The police are totally useless. So true, Chie. Chie, absolutely based. <laughs> <laughs> Nanako is gonna get a stab dad. Ah, my steak's getting cold. Oh my god. Could you shut up about the steak for five seconds? <laughs> you waited for the two to finish eating and then decided to go into the TV world. Yay. They do. He is inside the TV. That's such like a fun friendship. And I love that like, 
uh, especially Yukiko and Chie, but like they're all pretty friendly before you step in. Um, it's just really cool. It's a very fun dynamic. Hello, Teddy. It's Teddy. Then it wasn't a dream. Are you feeling better, Yuki-chan? I did what you said. I've been a good bear. Oh, I see. Good boy. <laughs> oh, well, this bear's part of the reason we want to find the culprit. I'm one of the group now, too. Let's work together, okay? Yep. I was thinking the same thing. That's why I got these ready <gasps> for you, Yuki. A pair of glasses? Beautiful. So these are what everyone's wearing. Thank you, Teddy. You're right. It's just as if the fog doesn't exist. Hey, tell me something. How come you have so many pairs of glasses? Excellent question. Guess what? I'm the one who makes them. What? I've lived here for a long time, so I came up with some ways to be comfortable here. I see. But don't you need a pair? Ooh, good point. Another great question. Listen to this. My eyes themselves are lenses. You didn't know? Of course not. <laughs> Can we just poke you in the eye? so mean? You act like you're not interested. I'm a really dexterous bear. See how smoothly my fingers move? Teddy is delicately moving his fingertips. I would like Teddy to stop delicately moving his fingertips. What am I even looking at? <laughs> you dropped something. Why do you have this pair of glasses, Teddy? Oh, that's a pair I kind of screwed up on. Ooh. <laughs> I love you, Kiko. You, Kiko? <laughs> How do I look? Incredible. It looks great. <laughs> Do you like that one, Yuki-chan? I want to wear this one. It's even got a nose guard. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. How very unfortunate. That pair doesn't have the right lenses in. Guess I should have made an actual pair. Please hold the lenses so Yukiko can have the glasses she wants. Ah, uh, too bad. Here, Chie, your turn. <laughs> it's so nice to see Yukiko having fun after like how sad she was in her dungeon. It's so nice to see her just having little giggle fits. <laughs> Yukiko-san? Hello? There goes one of Yukiko's <laughs> beds. I never thought she'd do it when someone besides me was around. These stupid glasses are useless for investigating. I mean, what the hell's this nose for anyway? Nice work, huh? That's what happens when you guys leave me here alone and I get bored. Well, I'm glad that she's in high spirits again, I guess. Chie, the look on your face. <laughs> it was so funny. I can't stop. <laughs> oh, oh, my stomach. <laughs> Aww. She's a little gooba. You decided to go back for today. Bye, Teddy. Be alone again, sucker. Get wrecked. The fourth and the fifth. I think I might be able to get the fourth and the fifth off. Yeah? Really? Papa? Really? What, you don't believe me? It's always cancelled. Mm. 
not every year. I know you wanted to go to Jeunes, but I wouldn't mind going a little further out of the neighborhood. Really? <laughs> Can we go on a trip? Uh, well, it might be okay to go on a trip once in a while. I'm sure it'll be crowded everywhere, though. Yay! <laughs> We're going on a trip! Hmm. All right, all right. Then we need to think of some place to go. How about you? You want to come along with us? Yes, I want to come. Yeah, well, let's all go together. <laughs> Looks like Nanako wants us all to go. You'll be going on an outing with the Dejimas during the long holiday. Let's bring box lunches. Okay. Hmm? Yeah, good idea. We're always eating side dishes for dinner. But uh, I can't cook, and Nanako's not good enough yet to make them by herself. Hmm. Well, it'll work out. That's what we got this guy for, huh, Nanako? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Yay! Box lunches! Yay! Yeah. Nanako is pleased. You've been selected to pack the family's box lunches. I want a mini cooking game right now. Okay. Judge Nanako all you want for wanting to go to Junez. Honestly, when my mom is like, yo, I'm going to Costco this weekend. Do you want to come? I get actively excited, so... Like, imagine going to Ikea for the day. Like, that's a pretty good day. That's a fun day out. That's... You just get to hang out with your family, and then you just... And then... Nanako based. <laughs> vacation, vacation, I can't wait. The vacation, huh? Should we make reservations now? Probably. <laughs> Just wanted to go IKEA. Yeah! Exactly. I'm 100% the kind of friend who want to go on an adventure and the adventure is a Whole Foods. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's just like, if you're not like... Obviously, Nanako's situation is very like... She doesn't get to hang out with her dad and that's all she wants to do. So she's not going to ask her a lot, I don't think. But... I don't know. I think maybe when like... I don't know. I think for me, like genuinely going out... And hanging out with my parents like I don't know how to phrase it like I have actual fond memories of like going to a supermarket supermarket like and shopping with my parents because I'm just like yeah that was the time we got to hang out you know as someone who grew up in a small town where friends would gather just at a local shopping center and goof around in a grocery store while my hits home yeah exactly like, I, I've never lived in like a big city. So maybe I'm just like, yeah, it's just nice to hang out and like have a good vibe for a few hours. Especially if your parents work a lot, like my parents uh, always worked. So yeah, maybe it was just that you got to hang out with them. I think that's like the big thing. Um, yeah. Um. Anyway, can we go outside? Are you cool with that? And why do you think you're going? Listen, I'll say this once, so listen close. Maybe it's normal for kids like you to be goofing around outside at night back in the big city. But this isn't the city, it's the countryside. And your mother trusts me to keep you safe. You're not a kid anymore. I just have to trust you when you're out of my sight. But I can't let you just run around at night, you get me? So that's it. Don't go wandering around at night if you don't have any reason to go out, all right? That's very base, Ajima. I like that parenting style. I like that I trust you, you trust me, we trust each other, and very nice. Please hang around more. I like it when you're here. Thank you. Let's read some more beginner fishing. 
after my parents divorced me those earnings are especially important yo big same like once my parents separated it was even more of a thing um yeah i completely agree um Nanako is just like how I was with a kid. Yeah, she's a she's such a beautiful character so far, honestly. When he let you go, I was say, he was working for the police and he has seen the this is the dead bodies that have shown up. So maybe maybe he's not wrong. Uh, the author's advice for those just learning how to fish is to not lose heart after hours of waiting for a bite. Willpower. Damn, I'm gonna fish so good. I know it. Okay, tomorrow we have to watch the channel. I have to remember this. We have the day from school today. You wonder if someone will show up on the midnight channel tonight. Oh, okay, I'll look at it tonight. Hello? Oh, hello, it's me, GA. Do you have the time to go inside the TV today? Now that Yukiko is with us, I think it might be good for her to get some experience being in that place. Just give us a call if you want to go. See ya. What about exploring the TV world today? Gee, I don't know how to use my phone. You can now watch other things besides the phone of- what? Released. <laughs> we don't have to watch it anymore. Hi, Minnie. Enjoy your luck. And welcome back, uh, Celestis. And hello, Salmon. How's it going? And hello, Fame Titan. Hello. <gasps> yes, they do share a VA, which is pretty cool. Hi, Nanako. <laughs> Very base, Nanako. Just find your channel by watching your gameplay on DMC3 and your reactions were the funniest shit. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed. Welcome. Kai, perfect. Kai it is. Um, yes. See you, Nanako. Sorry, Nanako. I wish I could hang out with you forever, Nanako. Golden Week's gonna be sweeping everyone up pretty soon. You'll be having the time of your life at your age, won't you? Can't say I'm not a little jealous being my age and retired. <laughs> but I guess you could say I'm always on vacation, so it's about the same thing, I suppose. I thought I'd find all the happiness I needed in just being able to eat whatever I want. But now that I've been living by myself, I've been a little lonely. That's why I end up coming here to take a walk. I can't do anything at the main house. My daughter's family doesn't trust me at all. Oh. It's... Oh, hold on. I'm sorry. I did. I played through both of them. If you're curious, they're on my, um... The, like, full playthrough is on my VOD YouTube channel. But eventually they'll be edited into highlights for the main YouTube channel. Um... I'm working on a lot of highlight videos, so I cannot give a time estimate for that, I'm afraid. Do you happen to have a fish hook? You don't? I'm not surprised. Ha! Huh, why, there's no hook on my line. Did a fish take it the last time I went fishing? I can't remember anymore. Hey, you have a little sister, don't you? I saw her, her with you once before. I have a sibling too, an older sister, but... Honestly, I'm a little uncomfortable around her. Funny! Oh my god! Wait. Aren't you- wait. 
business? Don't say yes or no. But I swear, this is the guy who is the cheat. Bonus offer. I won't. Thank you very much for looking out for me. Um, it is a man. A man? What? In my video games? Um, no, I, I've been very good with editing because I needed a break from Persona 5, so I edited some Final Fantasy 15 and then I cried like three times whilst trying to edit Final Fantasy 15 because I just love that game so much. But it was a very good break and it meant I didn't feel burnt out anymore. What is a man? What is a man? Thank you, Sal. I hope you have a good day. Who in the world could have done such a... It's horrible. It's too horrible. I think that's the cheating man. I have not played Final Fantasy XIII, no. Um, how far in the game are you? Very early days. Very early days. Just um, the first dungeon. Uh, you know that TV show? The one you spend all that money on? Do you mean Tanaka's wonderful commodities? They've just started selling new merchandise. I end up spending so much money when I watch that show. So much money. Okay. A lovely man. I read it and it was great. It made me feel pumped up with courage. Yeah, I read some of that book. It scared me. Avid reader. Do you have anything new to say? Just now, the strange animal came leaping out of the bushes by the north side of the shopping district. It wasn't a cat. It wasn't a dog either. I don't know what the heck it was. I should have known all these crazy animals running around out here in the sticks. Are you doing okay? You seem pretty terrified as a countryside in general, King. Uh... Oh my god, hi! Come on! Hey, wanna go inside the TV now? There's no harm in getting some real combat experience. Um, no, I'll, I'll go later. Yeah! Okay. I just wanna talk to everyone, Chie. You know, I. Oh my god, you, young woman. No, you're a questionable young woman. Hey, did you see it too? You know, that former- It is him! That former councilman secretary, uh, matame son. You know, from that incident. The murder one. Murder! <laughs> he had an affair. The affair was uncovered, and then his mistress was killed. Must be horrible for him. Must be horrible for him. He is having the worst time of his life. Must be the worst for him. I can't feel sorry for him though. Okay, good. Based. I mean, he did have an affair. He even failed at his job. Even though he returned to Inaba, he's a cheater. He's a dirty cheater. Men like him are worthless. <laughs> good. Yeah, you had me in the first half. <laughs> Poor guy lost a wife and a mistress. <laughs> so true, queen. <laughs> it's really interesting, Hat Lady. Smack dab in the heart of Tokyo. Thank you. Thank you so much, Coffee Tan, for the prime. Thank you so much. Welcome. I hope you enjoy all the emotes. Thank you so, so, so much. I hope you're doing good today. Uh, look at my little prime hat. It is the most beautiful prime hat. Um, heck yeah. It is interesting though, because Adachi was saying like, he like, because his career's over, he says like, he's as bad as the dead woman. <laughs> and like, whilst I'm like, Adachi, you're wrong. It's very interesting to think about in terms of like, the culture and the what they're trying to say about the like male sympathy and that sort of thing hi megan 
Oh, I'm glad you had a nap. I'm doing well, thank you. Your emotes are so cute. Thank you. I hope you enjoy them. Yes, Adachi was saying that like the uh, Namatame-san was as much of a victim as the woman who got murdered was. It is a, which is a take. It's a take. It's a sure is a opinion, but it's an interesting opinion of which I am like interesting that the game is saying this. I hope it is not just saying it. I hope it is like, it would be cool if it was like a point to the game. My grandmother really hates the fact that young people leave Inaba for the city life. But it really can't be helped. This place doesn't have much to offer. You came here from the city, right? You live with De Jima's son and his daughter, I've heard about you. So you understand, don't you? There's nothing for young people here and it can't be helped. Sachiko-chan, what are you flapping your gums about? What's wrong with the shopping districts here? Well, the, shop the shops don't have much variety. If I don't go to Juna's, I won't have what I need to make dinner. <laughs> Rival school student, hello. The police still haven't caught the killer? Those idiots! Can't they t uh, do anything right? I tell you, the world is chock full of idiots. Take those morons that ride around on bikes in the middle of the night, for example. Guys like that can't do anything without each other. They're worthless. And let me tell you, the student from a rival school runs it on and on. Nice. I saw the news. This fog is horrible. I don't think I've ever seen it this bad. Well, it's here now anyway, and it's doing more than just increasing the number of traffic accidents. That's what the news is saying, but there's more to the problem than just the fog. Your endless void eyes are doing me a concern. They remind me of uh, Lumi from Hunter x Hunter. <laughs> Yo, Yukiko! Your outfit is so cute! What the hell? Sorry, yo. Let's go into the TV. Uh, yeah, let's go to the TV. Oh, we're going already? That's what you wanted to do. I'm doing what you want. I, what? I'm doing this to please you. Hot starts. Hot studs, hot studs, hot studs, hot studs, hot studs, hot studs. There you are, Sensei. I'm so bored. I forgot to tell you. For some reason, I feel a powerful shadow in the castle. Oh. Maybe this world is getting unstable from people going in and out. I don't think this shadow is related to the culprit, but I don't like it being here. I'd be happy if you could defeat it for me. Uh... Teddy, I'm not getting the good vibes. Um, to be honest, uh, I sort of forgot what the castle is. B -b -b I'm sure Chie-chan and Yuki-chan didn't forget. You should ask one of them to show you where it is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I made these the right way this time. Teddy Ramachrava for producing something. Ta-da! Brand new gag glasses. But Yuki-chan's request, they have lenses in them. Oh, really? Thanks, Teddy. Hey, Chie, let's put these on. This again? We did it before. There's no need to do it again. Come on, Teddy. Don't get all excited just because Yukiko's a goof. Hehehe, <laughs> you're too kind. Hot studs, hot studs, hot studs, and a bird. Um, thank you, that is a beautiful command, Duke. Um, what's your character called? Um, Shoake. Wit, which is the, um, ship name of, uh, 
of uh, Joker and Akechi. Because my first name last time was Suriku, which is the ship name of Sora and Riku from Kingdom Hearts. And then their surname is always Crime Boy. And then um, now that is that is the naming convention. And they are distant family relatives. Oh, ah. Oh, nah. That's way too hard. Oh, oh my jeez. Okay, never mind. Um. Huh? You came? You're inside the TV, right? I can't ask you to go outside with me when you're inside the TV. Come back here when you have some time. Oh, okay. I see, I see. Okay, sorry. Sorry. Peace out. Suriku, Suriku was a good boy, full of crime. Just chock full of crime. Bow, bow, bow. Hi, Spectre, what's up? Bow, bow, bow. I was like, wow, Hannah's ooh face looks just like the emo. And then I was like, she is the emo. <laughs> A little bit. It's all thanks to you that I'm here, isn't it? Shwaki-kun, I really want to thank you. Go to the castle. <laughs> Ignored. Huh. Well, here we are. But is there something we gotta do here? Nothing is happening. This place is as peaceful as can be. It's not like the world's gonna end, so don't let it bother you. If we talk to you, we leave? Getting hit on by girls. What a shocking encounter. You were never hit on by anyone. I remember, even if I'd rather not. Oh, I really don't want to be here. Is this where the shadow is? Can we walk around or is it just here? Or oh, okay. Let's go! I sense the presence of a strong shadow in the room Yuki-chan was in. Sensei, you should defeat it. Oh my god. Oh, hello. Nice. I hope you have a good rest. Uh... Actually... It's kind of awesome that even now even Yukiko can use a persona. True. I'm wearing those nose glasses. I'm so sad that your portrait isn't though. <laughs> Do they look good on me? Maybe they should become a part of my regular look. <laughs> you gotta fix this show, okay? Once I see her wearing these things, I can't concentrate anymore. Really? <laughs> Don't worry, you'll get used to seeing me in them after a while. <laughs> Aw, that's cute that it changes because I put her in them. Yukiko's joined the team. I'm still a little worried for her, but it's still cool. Ah, that's cute that it responds to the outfit I put her in though. I like that. Very cool. Um. I'm good, thank you. I, d I don't want to fight you. I have fucked up. I have made a mistake. I have made an error. It's fine. I think I... I don't remember. I think if I talk to Teddy... Hold on. What's up, Teddy? I'm all for more girls joining the team. I, I didn't want to... 
I should never talk to Teddy. Teddy, I thought you could like speed us through some things, but I've forgotten how this game works. Okay, we'll just do it slowly this time, but then I'll figure it out next time, maybe. <laughs> this was a mistake. You should never have talked to Teddy. <laughs> it is the worst move you could have made. Um, I would like to remain in the pure vibes of Teddy, of just like, he's just a little lad. I don't think I want to know too much about Teddy. Like, I think knowing too much would be worse. It'll just hurt in the long run. <laughs> just gonna keep a safe distance, you know? Oh, I don't think we have any keys. He's simply a little dumbass. He's just a little empty-headed boy right now, and that's kind of how I want to keep it. It might be time to replay this game, even though I have literally 11 times. That's so rad. I'm so glad you enjoyed it that much. He has no, no idea what these things he's saying mean. True. No, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. Don't worry about the whole like giving Yukiko practice of fighting, it's fine. She's expert already, I just feel it in my bones. Um he's just a he's like a little toddler. He repeats things he likes like repeat repeats things he hears, like a sponge, especially when it's stuff you get mad at him for saying. Is that what toddlers do? I have to say, I do not interact with many toddlers, um, but I will accept this as true. Oh, wrong button again. Where does an M-rated game using Teddy as a Morgana as that mascot? Oh, as in like you think they seem to like childish for an M-rated game? Still haven't 100 percented I've never intentionally 100 presented any game, so I'm so impressed at people who do 100% uh, runs. So that is pretty cool that you're even uh, close. Ooh. I smell three enemies. Don't get careless. I'll try. Hasoda. Hasoda. I think it's our kids. Really? That's interesting. I can't say I ever thought before, like when I knew nothing about this game, I don't think I ever thought it was for kids for some reason. It's not working. This can't be. <laughs> this can't be. Three enemies left. No mascot. Yeah, I don't think I really got like the. Hands. What mascot characters are for? Like what the benefit of them is? You're awesome, well Sensei! Go, go, go! <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I am awesome, it's true. Throw down! Someone else's turn. So you're gonna have people dress up at the movie conventions and marketing. Fair enough, I guess. <gasps> she is wearing her goggles! Look at her! Hell yeah, queen.
When I was 13? Do you not get age? Need? ID or anything? Up we go! Two enemies left! Some thick skin. I say this as someone who gets ID'd for monster, so you know. Oh, I can't defeat it! That's one! Oh. Oh. One enemy! Fight! 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 Go forth. There. Oh. I think her persona it. is literally like my favorite persona design. It is so beautiful. Can you scan? Ah, lady! <laughs> you got ID for Monster? Yeah, in the UK you have to be over 16 to like buy drinks with a certain caffeine level. Um, which I agree with, I think that's a smart move. But uh, I'm 24 and I still get ID'd, so that's fun. <laughs> Literally the day before I turned 24, I got ID'd for buying Monster. <laughs> I was like, oh. Should we shoot it? Nice. What is the drinking age? 18. Sensei! Are you okay, Sensei? But you can have alcohol, like, so our laws are like 18 generally, but then like at a pub you could have like uh, a cider with your meal if you're from like 15, I think. Maybe 16. Um, so yeah. And honestly, pretty much every British child drinks before the age of 18. You go to get drunk on a field somewhere. It is the tradition. Sensei, wake up! Here. That's my true strength. Good job. I leveled up. Hell yeah. Um. Sensei, are you okay? Your health's low. Hey, Sora, right. it's no big deal. It is mad to me the drinking age being 21. I will like never understand that. Feels too much like taking medicine. I don't really drink anymore. I used to like, when I was like 16 to uh, like 19, 20, I drank like a fair bit, but it was like, uh, I would drink nothing, but then I would drink a lot at like parties. And now I just, I'm like, no, I don't. I have like one gin and that gets me stupidly tipsy and that's all I need. <laughs> then I'm done. <laughs> Two enemies. You can attack before them. We are immature enough to drink at that point. Twenty-one is too young. <laughs> um. True Sam, hello. How's it going? Um. When you drink a lot of uh, young, the shine kind of goes off after a while, I feel like. Yeah, I agree. Like, and that's why I'm kind of happy that, you know, I was just thinking that gem. I was like, I really want to say a true gem, but I know that's not right because it's not a gem star. <laughs> but hello, lovely new name. Very good. Um, I, kinda, I kind of agree. I think because I drank quite a lot when I was younger, 
it actually means now that I don't, um, I, like, I just don't drink now. Like, I'll have, like, a glass, and that's enough. That's all I need. Um, and also, it takes away, like, the drinking is so cool in WoW, because by the age of, like, 18, I was kind of, like, over it already. My parents were always really chill about me drinking a lot, so I never cared to. Yeah, I definitely- my parents were very chill about it as well. Um... You're doing great, don't worry, queen. They just, like, laughed at me when I had a hangover. Like, I remember the first hangover I had, I was, like, 16 or 15 or something. And I, like, threw up, it was bad, it was a bad time. And they were just laughing at me. So. Same! For me, it was like the hangover was so unbelievably miserable that, like, I just was like, I don't think I like drinking. I. Hangovers are awful. My whole body just feels. Dead. It's miserable. I do not enjoy drinking to that point at all anymore. I don't know how my young- like I'm 24. <laughs> like I'm not even old by any means, but I'm like, I don't know how my younger body did it. Because I like when I was in university, I would go out drinking like four times a week to the point of like hangover. And I, I don't know how. Because I just am like, no, I'm like, <laughs> I just want one drink and then I'm done. I'm tipsy. I don't need anything else. I don't want to get a hangover. No. One bad hangover and I said never again. Why is Yukiko wearing those glasses? Because she wanted to and they make her laugh and they make her happy. Hey, Hannah. Hello. Join P4. One of my favorite games. I am. Thank you so much, Justin. Uh, thank you for the five months. I'm really liking it. It's such a... The atmosphere of the game is so good. Um, welcome back. I hope you're doing well. <sighs> Are you ready, Sensei? No. I had the worst hangover of my life at 17. My mom had to pick me up and let me sleep on the kitchen floor because she couldn't carry me up the stairs. The day after the whole extended family was supposed to come visit and go on a trip. So they all came in and had a look at me when I got up to my room. Absolutely hate getting drunk after that. Yeah, Jesus. Yeah, I was the same. Like I had, I think I was 19 and I had like the worst hangover. I don't know what it was. I was like a hot tub. Like I'd been drinking and had been in a hot tub. And I think like that combination left me like super like dehydrated and like bad. And it was just the worst hangover. And I just couldn't do anything all day. And I was like, this is miserable. I hate not being able to do anything. And that was when I was like, no, I don't want to drink anymore. Thank you for following. You're allergically brain so likely to develop addiction, from what I understand. Um, yeah, I, I wouldn't be surprised with drinking young and that sort of thing. Luckily, I was never... I think um, the addiction side of thing is definitely a more intense thing. Because at least in the UK, my experience of like university life and drinking young was like, you would do it, like you would drink a lot, but it would be like one night and then you wouldn't drink again for like three weeks or something. Or at university, like it would be uh, more frequent, but whatever. And then so, so many of my friends um, when I was that age had the same experience as me or like Penguin as well, where it was like we had one really bad hangover pretty young and then just like never felt the need to drink again, which for me, I'm happy it worked out that way. Um, I don't feel any need to ever have like a glass of wine with a meal. I don't have any want to drink alcohol. I'll sometimes have a gin and lemonade if I'm feeling fancy. And I'm very happy about that. Um, yeah. 
Let's open the door. Oh, hello. He doesn't seem so bad. Okay, we'll kill him. That's a strong enemy. Don't get hurt. Just one enemy left. There was always one enemy, you silly little goose. It's not working. What is this? He's just standing there menacingly. He's trying his best. I love her weapon. Oh my god, I only just realized her weapon was the fan. Very cool. I like that. Absolute nightmare. Oh no. Yosuke's hurt. Someone do something. Sensei, your defense is down. Maybe we're not. Maybe maybe we should have done levels actually. One enemy! Fight! 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 Mm. How many revival? Mm. bad time. It's down. Yukiko? We have My queen? Yikes, it's tough. It is our pretty. With you, Yukiko. This is it. Ladies? Did that do it? That did like nothing, but it was incredible. Ladies. Come on, take that was beautiful. The music? That was... We're all gonna die. <gasps> we are all gonna die. We need... Uh, we're not ready for that. We need to go. We need to... We are... Um... This game is a lot harder than Persona 5. I got. Yuki-chan's in danger! Help! Someone! Bro, I would like you to go away. Amazing, Sensei! Keep it up! Thank you, Betty. Persona! Just keep missing. Oh. Get up, Sensei! Someone help! Okay, so I think we now need to um go away and not fight this man. Um. Uh, yeah, and then um, then we'll just we'll just. Oh oh no no mind. Oops. Can I leave? Okay, I need to figure this out. Enjoy your luck. You can't beat him. I. That's very nice of you to believe in me. I don't believe in myself. the game so you skip enemies. I think we need some items as well. Um, oh, but we don't have that much money. Okay, maybe what we do. We're gonna kill some... We're gonna... Oh my god, are we actually gonna have to do battles in this game? 
stinky. Imagine actually doing fights in a persona. Imagine being leveled in a persona game. I just want to be under love. No. Okay, good. I don't want to fight you. You freak me out. Um. Imagine not being under leveled. I smell two enemies. Beat them up. I'll try. Oh my god. It's not going down. Two enemies! Charge through them! Oh. Awkward. Yikes, it's tough! Ba down, ba down. Oh, I didn't mean to him. That's okay. I can't defeat it. I love how frustrated she sounds with herself. And she's like, I can't do it. She ain't chance down! This isn't good! Get wrecked. Oh. Yes, definitely be careful with Persona 3 because I want to play it. Um, in the future. Up we go. Thanks, you'll stay. Thank you. You have very few tools. Mm. Makes all sense. This'll be a piece of cake for Yuki-chan! ba 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 She ain't chance down! This isn't good! Are you the murderer? You seem to be picking on the ladies! One enemy! Fight! 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 You think that's okay, huh? Actually, the murderer. I couldn't do it. Ow! Jeez, that hurt! Come on! Take it! Couldn't quite beat it. Sorry, yes, the females. As they are absolutely uh, cool. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Great work! Um. <laughs> We play Persona 4 in the future. Are you all right, Yosuke? You're hurt! Um, I believe I'm playing it right now. Unless you mean not the golden version. Yep. Two enemy shadows! That's some thick skin! Two enemies! Charge through them! Has summertime jam energy. It's beautiful to me. It's like beautiful 90s intro jams. Couldn't quite beat it. Just kidding. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I was like. I'm, I think I'm playing Persona 4. I need to break it to you. <laughs> Couldn't quite beat it. <laughs> oh my god, Yosuke, your health. I'm so sorry, King. It's fine. You're fine. And it's shuffle time, Yosuke. <laughs> so don't worry, bud. You're fine. Pew, 
Great. Great. I won't fall behind. Can't wait for Hannah to play for Sonic Five Royale for the first time. Yeah, me too. Imagine. I wonder what that uh, catchy kid's about. I've had pancakes. This is too tough. I'm at my limit. Uh, have you heard of a, a pancake before? Oh, we do have treasure chest keys. <laughs> Let's go get that other chest, eh? <laughs> um, thank you for the follow. What is that noise? What the hell is going on? Hello? <laughs> Why does this game turn into a horror game every now and then? What's happening? Yosuke, your health. Oh, I forgot to heal Yosuke. An ambush by three enemies. <laughs> Don't cry. I'm <laughs> crying. Yosuke barely has any health! Yosuke needs to stop being a little baby. Thanks. Three enemies! Let's get through this! Thank you for the follow. <laughs> piss baby Yosuke. He's a little piss baby. He's trying his best. Oh wait, I don't think this was the move. <laughs> this can't be! We suck, man. By we, I do mean me. Uh, Yuki chan, this doesn't look good. Yuki <laughs> chan's down. This isn't good. Ladies, ladies, ladies. What's going on, huh? What's happening? <laughs> My man, stop. Almost <laughs> empty. What's going on? <laughs> Up we go. Yosuke will be replaced. Yosuke will never be replaced. Yosuke, my king. Yosuke. No way. Someone else's turn. I can still do this. Yosuke is a good little boy. Hi, Grandwala. How's it going? I've had such good things about uh, the world ends with you. Mainly that it's super underrated. So. This is going expertly, honestly. I, am now. I never let him leave my party. He's trapped forever. That hurt? I do also like it's very funny whenever I talk about characters like um, on Twitter or on YouTube or whatever. And people like if I'm ever talking about characters, just know that it is never about the skills that they have. Literally never. Uh, so like I tweeted about like Mishima and how I think Mishima in Persona 5 is like the most underrated character ever and like I got some replies of just being like well when I once I figured out his like rank 10 ability I liked him it's never about that it's never about that ever uh, so if I just like that vibes they will be on the team they, they might be the worst <laughs> player they might be miserable but they'll still be on the team because I like them. Good work, Sensei. So, just know that I never do anything based on skill. Two enemies left. Ever, like Fire Emblem. I went on pure vibes, and somehow I made two characters so insanely OP that they had. Yeah, I might have punched the end boss 
with no weapons to death. Just um, it's not going down. And that's just that's just the way I vibe, you know. Nice, Chie. Okay. Ah, look at all of us. Beautiful. Oh. Two more enemies. You gotta hang tight. You were on easy. On what game? Three houses? I was on normal. Unless you mean casual. By easy. Two enemies left! I couldn't do it. That was easy. No. Chan sure is powerful. It was not. It's down. Uh -huh. Okay. Ha! <laughs> 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 On hard, <laughs> why won't do that? <laughs> so far. It's down. Okay. Is when I know the weaknesses, like Okamura. Yeah, I think Okamura. I changed. I don't remember. Who. I think I swapped out Ryuji for Okamura. Because I know my party was Yusuke, Haru, Makoto, Joker. I think I swapped out Ryuji, but that was like the only time. And then on the very final boss, uh, on no, on Yaudabalth, I swapped out. I had to, <laughs> like, I'd never used Arna Morgana past like the first or second palace, I guess. And they had their moment to shine. <laughs> um, they got that moment. Swapped out all the team. Everyone got swapped out. Every single character was used to defeat Yadavel. <laughs> Otherwise, it was not happening. <laughs> ah. You don't want to embarrass everyone who got stuck at hard. That's true. You know, you can only first time so many bosses before you just don't want to, like, show anyone up. on PC. No, I think it's only on Switch. That's what I played on anyway. XP stayed really equal across party members. Yeah, I that maybe that would have been a good idea. <laughs> it's one of those things that I'm like, that's a good idea. An idea I'll probably never put into place. But that makes a lot of sense for a smarter player than I. What is this noise? Huh? Hang in there! Persona! Persona! <gasps> you hit his nice weakness! Move, Smart move, Sensei! I just normally put the character in the party. I do that for sure. Like, I always wanted, in Persona 5, I always wanted whoever's arc it was to get the final hit. This is it! Oh, that's so cute! Um, nice girls. So like, Haru, I wanted to have the last hit. Makoto, I wanted to have the last hit on there, like against Okamura and kind of kind of Shiro. So yeah. Um, I think we'll just go with that. Nice. Oh, 
Kara gets to murder her father. Yeah, nice family bonding experience. I'm pretty sure I catch him. There are two enemies! Hang in there! Maybe. Maybe I perhaps titled the stream Calling a Kumara. And it was a foolish move. Nice! Good job, Yosuke. It's a funny smell. Father hasn't moved in five days. I can't defeat it. Is that normal? Yeah, it hurts. It's, it's normal. Don't worry about it. That's one. Nice job, Chiechan. Sleep well, Kai. Thanks for hanging out. I hope you have a good one. Oh, you well, two enemies beat them up. We are so cute. Yes, it was very much what I wanted to do. It was, yes. It was a great time for everyone. So persistent. What dungeon? Uh, this is Yukiko's dungeon. Uh, but we're just killing a shadow thingy. Enemy reinforcements! Hurry and beat them! Three enemies left. Throw down. Persona. That's some thick skin. Go for it. There. I couldn't do it. You're doing great, honey. Stop putting yourself down. You're doing excellently. Oh. Escaped! Only two left! Persona! That's fine. No one stands in Sensei's way! Throw down! Oh, you. It's not going down. Nice, Hosuke. 69. I can't defeat Just it! one enemy left! Take it! Couldn't quite beat it. Just in case. There! I couldn't do it. You're doing so good, Yukiko. See? <laughs> I get that does it. A team effort. <laughs> I don't know how long we're gonna level up until we go back to the shadow boy. But he is a pretty scary shadow boy. Hello! Honestly, I think we need to leave and get items. There are two enemies! Hang in there! But we might try with no items. <laughs> See what happens. Someone else's turn. Go for it. Don't tell me. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot Queen. My fault. Come on. Take it. Yikes! It's tough. Oh, but oh. Oh, but oh, but oh. It's 
not going down. Oh, so persistent. Yeah, I think we're gonna go items. I think that's the smart move. I have decided. Nice! Beat an enemy. Keep going. Just one enemy left. Beautiful, Yasuke. Let's keep going. So I've watched three people stream Persona 4 in the last week. Not really on purpose. It was just coincidence. <laughs> Hell yeah. Get all the Persona. Right, we are going to... Hmm. I don't understand you, Teddy. TBH, but it's fine. Uh, return to the entrance. Hot starts. Hot starts. Hot stats. Hot stats. Oh, that's oh. Um. I gotta go. I'm sorry. I need items. I know. I'm so. I'll see you later too, Teddy. Teddy, I'm sorry. Teddy, I'm just a little. I'm just a boy in a scary world. Welcome home. Hi, Nanika. Hope you had a good day. Quiz show time. Are you winning? <laughs> Saving every five seconds. Where I bought stuff last time, I won't be open now. I think we can have to buy stuff and then go. Oh, I can't even go out. <laughs> I forgot about this. I'm just so tired and sleepy. I must sleep. And now we have to watch the TV tonight. Cause someone's gonna die, probably. Oh. Good morning. It's raining. It's not going to last past nightfall though. Every time it rained while I was over there, you must have been. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't mean to be gloomy. I know, Golden Week starts tomorrow, right? Do you have any plans? Um, I'm having a family outing. I see. That must be tough. No, I love my family. But at least it looks like we're going to have clear skies all Golden Week. It'd be nice if it could stay peaceful like this, but the mystery hasn't been solved yet. Perhaps we should visit over there once in a while so we can become stronger. <laughs> Are you winning? Uh, absolutely. Always. Never mind. With this teacher, I am never winning. I'm hearing a lot of chatter about Golden Week, but don't forget this first and foremost, your students. Your duty is to study, and you don't have time to fool around, all right? Do not mis misunderstand what freedom means. It does not mean that you can live without taking responsibility. Even Pythagoras said, as soon as laws are necessary for men, they are no longer fit for freedom. Next order of business. Midterms are coming up next week. Their results will be posted to humiliate low scoring losers. If you don't want to be shamed, study hard. It's that simple. God, you're so inspiring. If you do well, who knows? You may become a more popular credit. And you know popularity leads to intimacy. Aren't you always saying that we aren't allowed to... 
On top of that, my reputation goes up. It's a win-win situation, people. Like I said, study hard. I'm so knowledgeable. We're gonna fail these quizzes. I honestly, I loved quiz time, mid times during <laughs> Persona 5. I think it's gonna go poorly this time. Will someone appear on the Midnight Channel again? You have no choice but to wait for another rainy night. It's true. Um, hmm. That girl said that the cultural clubs are looking for new members. She was in the drama club, but she said that she was trying to get people to join the other clubs too. Uh, I'm sure you can find out more. But, but you need to talk to Mr. Moroka. He'll yell at you for sure. Why does joining a club have to be so difficult? And, um, I have something to ask you. Will you listen to me? What is it? To be honest, I haven't been able to sleep lately. I'm afraid of so many things out there. But if I had some sort of charm, I could calm down and actually rest, I think. Like an angel statue or something. I get the feeling that it could protect me. Someone from the city like you should know where to get those things, right? Of course, I'll repay you. Um, how about I trade you my old good luck charm for it? It's a key. I don't exactly know what, I don't know what it's a key to exactly, but it seems like it could be worth a lot. Uh, okay, sure. Thank goodness. Well then, I'll leave it in your hands. I, it doesn't seem that lucky. It's run out of luck, eh? Jeez. Oh, Shwagikun. You don't know how relieved I am to see Yukiko safe and sound. Thank goodness we got her out of there. Oh, you want to talk to her? I think she's on the first floor building of the classroom building. First floor of the classroom building right now. But still, the test. Ugh. Are you free today, Shwagikun? Maybe you could treat me. Or not. Um... Maybe later, figures. Ah. Uh... Yo! Yo, Chuake. <laughs> Did you know that you can go fishing in Samagawa? What kind of fish would you get from that place? It's kind of creepy if you ask me. Ugh, just thinking about it gives me the jibblies. If you catch any, don't feed them to me, all right? Yes, Yosuke, I will not feed you the fish. Hello, student, do you need help? Are you okay? Uh, excuse me. Do you have a moment? I must speak to you on behalf of the Mystery Association. Or if you would prefer, the Occult Club. Surely a student of your tastes can appreciate the dark arts. Yeah. I knew it, just as it was foretold. <laughs> Perhaps you'd like a reading of your own? No, I'm getting carried away. Anyway, I was just about to get to the point of our little chat now, wasn't I? You see, I would really- I would like a really, really dark ornament for our club's room. That would be ideal, yes? After all, a lasting first impression is key. 80% of our choices are dedicated by that alone. So, you must journey to an old castle, where you will seek out the most evil-looking demon statue you can. It should be obvious, but you'll have better luck finding one if you look for a magician of sorts. <laughs> wink, wink. Um, I think that would satisfy our needs splendidly. So what do you think? You are capable of finding this, right? Naturally, you can expect a reward from us. Let's see. I have numerous things one might use to restore one's health. Catch my drift? Are you gonna give me drugs? Yeah, yes. Then all this is the higher being has foretold. Thank you very much. You should be rewarded handsomely. I'll get you some ibuprofen ASAP. Hello. Uh, good afternoon. Tests are coming up, you know. Are you going to study? Not really my thing. It's better to take action now than to be sorry you didn't later, right? That's why you should seize the chance to study on rainy days, because you'll make more progress. If nothing else, you should study just to avoid the embarrassment. Everyone can see your test scores. I'm going to the library today, but I don't expect to have my eyes on my work. What? Sure. I don't like it when it rains. All the music goes and I am sad. Um, what the hell is going on? Um, we must be careful not to mix this up and the girl who wants a good luck charm. <laughs> Please have the devil charm. Um, 
They do a little jibba jabba. I like them. The little sillies. Oh! Shawakikan. School seems really fun. I was looking around. It's thanks to you all. Thank you for saving me. Yukiko has a fresh smile on her face. But she seems to be somewhat uncomfortable. It seems you need some sort of opportunity to become closer. <gasps> oh! Like to get our social link. I see, I see, I see, I see. Cool. Right. Let's uh, study with Chie then, I guess. Oh, but what if that takes off to school? Okay, Chie, I'll come back. I think I could do that. I'll come back, Chie. I'll study with you. I just need to go buy us medicine and stuff. I need to keep us alive. And we're not very good at staying alive. Uh, was it? No. It was here, right? Today is a rainy day, so I'm having a sale. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Da, da. We have no money. We have no money. We have no money. We have no money. We are so poor. We have no. I was constantly broke. I, yeah. That does seem the vibe. <laughs> it's okay though. Oh, I wonder if we can. Hold on. Uh, Marie? Huh? You came. I'm surprised. I didn't think you were interested. Look, I'm sure you already know, but I... I want you to take me somewhere. It's small, it's dark, the nose never says anything. It's stuffy in here. Did you just call him the nose? I'm really not supposed to leave the room, but Margaret said it'd be okay if I went with you. Ugh, I... Never mind. Oh, will you take me somewhere? It seems Maria is intent on going out. If you become closer to her, maybe she could tell you something. Sure. Really? Don't you think you're giving in too easily? I'll have you twist around my finger if you keep this up. I think we're okay. Twist it around my finger. That's the saying, right? I've been studying. Let's go. Okay. I think we'll be okay, Marie. I'll, I'll try not to get too manipulated by you. Is cool as a simp? Soon to be simp. You took Maria out for a stroll in the shopping district. I can finally breathe now. It's stuffy in that car. Yeah. Oh, there's a kitty! You know, I feel weird. It's all like nostalgic for the smell and all. What smell? Smell of rain? Yeah, I can't really say why, I just got that feeling. There's a lot of stuff that I've never noticed before. A stink skewer? Hey. Lady, I want one of those things. <laughs> oh, hello, that'll be 320 yen, please. Also, this woman is the woman that I think is the murderer so far. It's difficult to say. Through three, three, honey, yeah. <laughs> Blah. That's hard to say. You can't eat without money. We can come back later. I'm not paying for you. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know when I'll have the chance. Marie looks sad. What's up? Yeah, my boy. Shwake, getting your steak on, huh? Yeah. She's cute. What? What's going on here? Who, who's this? Um, an acquaintance. Um, yeah, I guess that's right. Oh, is that so? 
Oh, uh, yeah. I'm Yosuke Hanamura. I'm his friend. His partner, you know? Partner? You mean like a close friend? Like, history would say you are friends? Like your roommates? <laughs> it about sums it up. <laughs> What's your name? Uh huh? Uh, Marie. Uh huh, Marie Chan, is it? You want a steak skewer? All right, this one's on me. You mean you'll buy it for me? Is that okay? It says money, man. I don't know. There's no reason to decline. You should reserve yourself. <laughs> That's great. There's no reason to say no. <laughs> hey, don't worry. I got a little extra on my last paycheck. Three steak skewers. One for each of us. Oh my, business is booming. <laughs> Just a moment, please. <laughs> Aw, that's cute. Whew! Is that a belly full of what? This place always has huge portions. So, Maru-chan, what do you think of the local speciality? It's really weird. It's tough, hard to bite into, and it's got cold while I was still eating it. It was delicious. Uh, that's good. Didn't sound like you liked it at the beginning, that. <laughs> but also, it also ends well. Hey. Hey. Why is it called steak anyway? Is it short for something? It's short for steak. Steak? That's stupid. Might as well call it ache. That's what I'm gonna do. That isn't much better. And you, don't tell her lies, she's believing it. You eat this every day? No fair, I should have come earlier. It seems Marie has taken a liking to steak skewers. You made small talk with your scare, Marie. Whoa. Oh crap, I left my key back in my locker at work. I gotta go back to Junus. See you later, Shawake. See you, uh, see you, Marie Chan. Peace out. Your partner? <laughs> Marie, you can say boyfriend. It's loud. It's not illegal. <laughs> Your partner is a funny person. <laughs> He's just my friend. <laughs> that he is. Huh. But he brought me meat. He bought me meat. That makes him a good person. That is fact. Hey, let's go somewhere else. Someone with a nice view. Bro, this is gay. <laughs> it's pretty gay if you ask me. The hill overlooking town. After several times in which you lost Marie, the moment you took your eyes off her, you managed to bring her here. Oh. It's really green here. Green and green, and some brown and darker green. Yeah. Leaves of green fly away, farewell to you, clouds of the sky. I fly as well, lost is the day. Farewell to you, moon of the night. Maria is murmuring something to herself. Whatever it is, it rhymes. I said no. No, I, I, I wasn't making up a poem. It's just some words that I was thinking. That's all, yeah. Shut up, I hate you, you stupid jag. Don't, don't snoop on me. What is that? Happening. Marie is blushing. I think Marie is living in her fantasy world and pretending that we are saying words. <laughs> what is going on? Wow, it's pretty big. I don't know why, but I feel good about this place. It reminds me of something. Are there any other places we can go? I want to see more. I think you should go away. <laughs> Um, I'll show you around. I don't mind. Please do. I notice a lot of things when I'm with you. It's pretty fun. Hi, Cardamon. How's it going? You sense that Marie expects something of you. You feel that you understand Marie a bit more now. Boom. Um... 
Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou should be blessed when creating personas of the Aeon Arcana. Nice. All right, next. Why do you now? See ya. You show Marie around, then escort her back to the velvet room. Nice. <gasps> an Inaba Credit Union ATM to the north of town was destroyed today by an earth mover, and all cash inside was stolen. Oh. What's an earth mover? The vehicle, which was abandoned at the scene, had been reported stolen by a local contractor. Since the culprit was able to act quickly before the security guards arrived on the scene, the police have... <sighs> Gonna go. That's late. No. Oh my god, you're braver than me. I can't even answer the telephone. Hello, Dad. Yeah, I'm okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, all right. Oh, do I have to talk to him? He said to give you the phone. Okay. <laughs> he can't take those days off. No! <laughs> Why? Oh. Everything sucks. Jima. Sorry, but I'm gonna be late tonight. Make sure you lock up before you go to sleep. Tajima, <laughs> man. You gotta do Tajima. Tajima, buddy, pal, king. Please. You promised. I was really looking forward to it. And about that time off on the 4th and the 5th, one of the younger guys got sick. And, well... That case he's handling, we can't just let it sit. Looks like I'm the only one who can take over for him. <laughs> Poor Nanako. Sorry to spring this on you all of a sudden. Um, how's Nanako holding up? You know how she is. Do you mind comforting her for me? Thanks. All right then. Nanako, let's hang out together. Nanako went back to her room. You recall that there is a test on Monday next week. Study? No! Nanako! Let me hang out with Nanako. I'm gonna eat a dried up pickle. It tastes really good. However, you don't feel well. And I got forced to go to sleep. <laughs> you had the day off from school. I wonder when it will rain at midnight again. Not a call. The cousins, yeah, we are. Okay. Nanako is watching TV today as usual. Sounds like someone's here. Oh. <gasps> Chie, I feel like you would be a very good presence in Nanako's life. I'm not going to lie. I feel like you would be a very fun energy for my sweet little baby cousin, technically sister, definitely. Oh, cool, you're home. Hey, if you're free today, want to go somewhere? Yukiko's coming too. How about you, Nanako-chan? Want to come? Yes, yes, um... yes, 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 yes. Come with us. Yes. 
to take Nanako out along with Chi and the others. Oh, I'm gonna cry. I'm fine. I'm gonna cry, but I'm fine. <sighs> Juna's food court. You met up with Yosuke. He's still on the clock and Yukiko, who finished her work back at the inn. Why'd you bring poor Nanako-chan to a place like this on Golden Week? Where else is there to go? I love Juna's. Nanako-chan. <laughs> but we we're supposed to go on a real trip somewhere. We we're going to make boxed lunches. Wow, you can make boxed lunches, Nanako-chan? <laughs> oh, so you're the family cook? Pretty impressive, big bro. Big bro. Oh no! Whoa, you can cook? <laughs> you do seem to be great with your hands. Uh, uh, never mind. <laughs> You're scary. At least not in front of everyone. <laughs> oh my god. It's a private thing that we do together. You're scary. <laughs> Pretty good cook too, you know. Probably. <laughs> You'd ask him to whip up some boxed lunches. He sees pie. Yeah. Uh, let me think about no. <laughs> <laughs> what makes you think I can't cook? Let's have a cook off and see for ourselves. My my, doth the lady protest too much? And hey, I never said I cooked. <laughs> But I have this weird feeling <laughs> like I'd win anyway. No. <laughs> I can understand that. Ugh. What the? Yukiko! <sighs> Here, Nanako-chan can be our judge. Mm-hmm. I bet we'll make something that ranks up there with your mom's cooking, Nanako-chan. I don't have a mom. She died in an accident. <laughs> mom law, yay. <laughs> I see. Um. Sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. Even if I don't have a mom, I have dad with me. And now I have a brother, too. I cannot cry this early in the game. Today. I love Juness. Yeah, that's good. Oh no. <laughs> we'll play with you anytime you want, Nanako chan. Yeah, we should hang out more often. Come on, Nanako chan. Let's go get a soda. Okay. <laughs> oh no. She's a strong girl. Yeah, she makes me feel like I'm the little kid here. That's it. I'm gonna go get something for Nanako-chan, too. Hmm. Oh. Do you want something, too? Nanako gives you a carefree smile. You look like... You feel a faint bond forming between you and Nanako. We get a little socially. Okay, I'm fine. Now oh, I am I am thou. That has such a new bond. It brings me closer to the truth. Justice. <laughs> I love the justice arcana. That is a good one. <laughs> oh. You have established the Nanako to dream of social link. <laughs> oh my god. 
I did not think I would be crying. Share some takoyaki? I love takoyaki. That's like one of my favorite foods, Nanakar. I'm so down. Sorry. Uh, I did not think I would actually cry at this this alley. Um, I it genuinely like. Real estate much? Place is smack dab in the heart of Tokyo. Um, breaks my heart, but also makes it that like she's getting this attention and she's so happy about it, but she isn't even like taking all of the attention for herself and just like being a little kid she's so mature and like comes back and asks if her brother wants anything and she <laughs> and when yuki goes like she's a strong girl oh my god um squire thank you so much for the prime sub welcome in thank you i hope you're doing well she is an angel. And like even Yosuke, like the fact that Yosuke like really steps in it accidentally. Um, I think he's really good at just being honest and being like, I'm sorry, I really didn't know. And Nanako is just so mature to be able to be like, it's okay. Like, I know you didn't mean it. And oh, oh, um, I guess just Justice Arcana's characters freak me up big time. They hurt me. They just, ow. Ow. Loving your playthroughs and commentary. Thank you. Thank you. That's so kind. Um, hi, Super Spotter. It's lovely to see you. I'm sorry to hear that, but I hope you enjoy your luck whenever we do get to see you. Ugh. Oh. You had a fun time with Nanako and your friends. I'm so glad we invited her. Oh. <laughs> Today was fun, huh? Yes. Justice Arcana's apparently have dead moms and brown hair. <laughs> Why did Justice Arcana's have to haunt me? Why? Why? Oh, if we hang out with uh dajima as well like literally um sojuro's confidant the last five ranks i think i cried at all of them and like even the lines he would say you know as you got better at making coffee and he would be like i'm gonna look after you too and all of that stuff it, it would just that would just make me cry when you would come in uh from school or going out and he's like oh i'm really happy to see you home safe i would just start crying <laughs> oh no all i could do is give you shelter <laughs> and then he, he's like, you can call me dad again if you want <laughs> I'm in agony. I'm doing great, actually. That's what I meant. Sorry. First time chatting here. Just wanted to hop in and say thank you for the great content. Thank you. Thank you for chatting. Welcome very, welcome very much. That doesn't make much sense, but I'm gonna stick with it. Welcome. Um, thank you. Oh. Yeah, I catch she was. That little. That little, little boy is miss him every day. Let's read fishing part three. Uh, okay, I can't actually just think about Akashi and start crying. We gotta think about fish. Fish. Um Don't lose heart. The willpower is very important. You have finished reading beginner fishing! You feel as if you will be able to fish longer now. We can't even fish yet, but we can fish longer than we fished before. Today is nature day, so you have the day off from school. Hell yeah. 
You wonder when it'll rain at night again. What should you do today? Hello? Hey, it's me. <laughs> Your partner. This might be kind of weird to ask after we hung out yesterday, but do you want to hang out again today? I'll see if I can find someone else to come along with us. Sure, I guess we can hang out. Um, but we kind of need to do that fight, I think. <laughs> oh, hey, why don't you bring Nanako-chan? I'll bring Nanako. Come on, Nanako. Oh my god, it's the four. Oh my god, it's the two. <laughs> I firmly believe that these two, are, that the two, the football and the basketball dude are in love as other ball boys, and then also these two. <laughs> I can't believe me and Yosuke are now fathers, and we have a child, and we're with our other, <laughs> with with our couple friends on a double date. <laughs> Amazing. Nanako Chan sort of loves this place. <laughs> The first thing out of her mouth when I asked where she wanted to go was Juna's. <laughs> Who could blame her? This place is everything. It's like a storehouse of magic. I can see why she likes it. Anyways, isn't she cute? <laughs> I have a younger sister too. I wish she was cute like Nana Kachan. Okay, rude. Oh, I'm not cute. Ah! Oh, did I hurt your feelings? <laughs> Don't worry, you're not cute. <laughs> Let's see that. <laughs> That's going kind of far. Hey, 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 hey! Are you stupid or something? That's the Daisuke I know. We barely know him. He's pretty dumb. <laughs> don't flatter me like that. <sighs> I don't think he is. The Big Bar. That TV is huge. If you want to go in it? That's not, actually. I feel like if I watch sports on a TV like this, I get sucked into the screen. Uh, yeah, like, come on, like that could happen. <laughs> it promises to be an entertaining day. You feel like your relationship with Yosuke is going to become closer soon. You feel like your relationship with Nanako is going to become closer soon. You feel like your relationship with the Bull Boys is going to become closer soon. My relationships are just blooming. <laughs> we went to Juno's today, huh? We sure did, cutie pie. <laughs> I love how Ku and a dice scare a package deal. I love it. Great. Good for them. Uh, do we want to go out? I don't think so. Our expression is rough? Score on the test, you may become well known among your classmates and be more popular. Yeah. I've always wanted to be so popular. It's very cool and very fun. Woo! There we go. Popularity secured. Uh, you read a number of dictionary entries that pique your interest. I love the dictionary. Wow, it's just so amazing to read and have fun with. You decide to go somewhere you don't usually go. Fast. The station. 
You decided to go to Yasuina Buzz Station. Wow, it sure is a station. No one is around. It seems like the next train won't be coming for a while. Buy a drink. You decided to go to the shrine in the shopping district on the way back. Okay. There's no one on the premises. The dusty shrine doesn't seem to be well maintained. You decide to go home. What a day. I oh. You sense someone watching you. Hello? A mysterious fox. Oh my god, it's the Father Fox Shrine. It suddenly appears before you. Does it live at the shrine? The fox is staring at you. You notice uh, an Emma plaque in its mouth. Oh, thank you. It nudges the Emma into your hand. Emma? Please help Grandpa's legs get better. The Emma has someone's wish written on it? Why did the fox give this to you? Upon closer inspection, you notice an unusually shaped leaf stuck on the back of it. You don't recognize the leaf from this local plant life. Is this also the work of the mysterious fox? Oh my god! Hello! Oh, not every day you see youngins like you around here. Nobody lives or here anymore. I come by to tidy things up once in a while, but lately my legs are so achy I just can't do it. I've been trying to get this place up to snuff, but there just isn't enough money to go around. Well, I suppose I'll pay my respects. My legs don't heal. If my legs don't heal, I can't maintain the shrine. That and I won't be able to visit Cater anymore. He's my grandson, you know. You wonder if it could be the same one. Huh? What's that you've got in your hand there? Could it be? The leaf, that's it! Way back when, my grandmother always used to say a leaf shaped like that was the best kind of ache remedy out there. Ah, what rare memories. But how do you get your hands on this? I don't think you could find those in the mountains anymore. P please, young man, can I trouble you to spare me that leaf? Yes, of course, you can have the leaf. Oh, this is it. This is it. Now, let's see here. The old man stuck the leaf onto his leg. Oh, I can feel it. It's working. Oh, amazing. The pain I've been feeling for who knows how long it just up and vanished. Mm -hmm. Why, I feel better than I have in years. You really helped me out, young man. I'm so grateful. Now I can go visit my grandson. You're welcome. I'd better pay thanks to this shrine, the shrine for bringing us together like this. Oh my. The pace. The speed. Not only did it heal his aches, it even restored his vitality. Hi, Foxy. The fox looks on from his hiding place with a contented expression. Thank you for the hydrate. have a little... I don't know. I want to say apron. The fox is peering into the off, uh, offertory box as if to check the contents. It se even seems to understand that the shrine has received an offering. Perhaps you were given the Emma with the leaf for that express purpose. Yeah, bib. Maybe apron. Yep. It seems it's taken a liking to you. Um, oh, maybe a cravat. That's what I'm going to call it. This is the fox's cravat. He's a fancy fox. It has a mouthful of the same leaves as the one you gave to the old man. It seems the fox has a large stock of mysterious leaves with healing powers. The fox is looking up mouthfully. Is this something it wants from you? 
You can't help but think how strange an encounter this is, as you realize the fox is showing you a pile of leaves. You feel a faint bond forming between you and the fox. <laughs> this is my social link. Fox social link. <laughs> thou am I. Thou, thou art I. Thou art what the hell's happening? Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou has established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shall be blessed when created. Fuck. Hermit? What's that? I think. Yeah! You're offering me? Yeah. Why does it find such amazing leaves? You reflect on how useful it would be to have this kind of help while searching the other side. Does it understand your thoughts? The fox gestures to- you want money? Is it offering its services for a price? I'm so broke. It seems the mysterious fox has agreed to aid you in your search. However, it appears that it will require a fee. Bro, I have 700 yen to my name. I'm not built for this kind of money. It's getting late. You decide to go home. Damn, today I was gonna go defeat that boss and now I just am like, wow, I guess I have a fox as a friend now. Oh, the prime no. suspect in yesterday's ATM robbery in northern Inaba was arrested earlier today. Yay. The alleged thief is Pomena Sushin, a 26-year-old former employee of the company which reported the stolen vehicle. According to the police investigation, Pomena Sushin was... I'm home. A bar. How many days is he gonna call in sick? These rookies lately sure are. Welcome back. Nanako. I'm sorry I broke my promise again. Oh, um, my big bro and his friends played with me instead. I see. Thanks. It's a Juness bag. <laughs> What's in it? <laughs> Good eye. Well, today is Children's Day, so I brought you a present. Yay! <laughs> Ooh, a T-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it took me a while to decide what to get you. You like it? I got you one, too. Not that you're still a child or anything, but fair is fair. Oh, hell yeah. Swimsuit. <laughs> Let's go. Thank you. Don't mention it. I thought you might need one soon. Will I? Well, then. Let's eat. Am I going to swim? Okay. Oh, oh. You spent a pleasant evening with the Dejimas. <laughs> My shot has a platypus on it. Doesn't that look funny? It looks so good. The ocean's a bit far away, but the river's right in town. I'm sure you'll end up taking a swim sometime this year. Make sure to wear that, okay? Okay. Dejima. I Oh. Trying not to cry. I just love the dreamer and had to go and they haunt me. Beach episode time. He's going to drown you. <laughs> Yay. Um. Okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Um. Then we will continue. Enjoy the jams.
got to live in this idol Hearing of the nation All I need is admiration Restoration Because life is sure we gave a shot Hello, I return. Oh, I'm so peckish, but I don't have any snacks. <laughs> bedazzled daddy issues. That's kind of daddy issues. The bedazzled kind. Okay. What are we doing? The, the, the scary boss thing, yes. Um, okay, good night, everyone. See you night tomorrow. Um, um, can we work? Yes. It was cute, thank you. That's very kind. Did someone say delicious pancakes? Pancakes. I don't want to hear that word for a very long time. Yay! And we have to watch the TV tomorrow. I think. Yo! <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Damn it, I just fixed this thing. <laughs> it's making squeaking sounds again. Oh no! Maybe you need a new one. Huh? Yeah. Hey, by the way. What's up? I'm sorry about the other day. You know, about what I said to Nanako-chan. It's okay. After hanging out with Nanako-chan, I feel even stronger that we have to solve this case. Hell yeah. Um, we'll do our best. Yeah. Yeah. You know, Chie and Yukiko seem different lately. They're a lot closer. They're lesbians, Yosuke. Oh yeah, I was just curious, but are you... I, never mind. You know, if we keep chatting, we're gonna be late. Oh, man, school's such a chore. And now my bike's messed up, too. The r ah! Uh, until I get my motorcycle license, I'll just have to walk. How do I see the log again? Does anyone know what the button is for the log? I accidentally skipped him, and I don't want to. <laughs> L3. Hmm. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be. X or Y? Wasn't that one either? <laughs> oh no. Hello, partner. What's up? What's going on? If you've got some freedom after school, let's go get a grub on. Maybe you should hang out with Yosuke after school. Yosuke, man. Everyone, I want to go to the do the boss shadow. Chie, no. Chie, no. No. Hey, if you have time after school, hang out with me, okay? When I'm not busy hanging off to school, you can usually find me hanging out on the roof. I mixed up so many words there. I'm so sorry. Oh, think about it. Maybe you should hang out with Chie after school. No. Please, I need to do the thingy that I meant to do. Oh, why do the holidays have to end so fast? At least they were peaceful. I listened in on the housewives gossiping at Juness, but it doesn't seem like anything happened. Nice. And I haven't heard anything about someone disappearing suddenly either. Nice. I think Yukiko could have been the last of the victims. Hell yeah. She's probably the last one. There's no more mm. victims to be had. I don't know. Everyone's safe and sound. But we shouldn't relax as long as the culprit remains at large. I wonder. I'm culprit, so sure culprit. We'll again if it rains. If we only knew a little more about who the killer might be. Eh, it's no good fretting over it now. If someone does show up on the Midnight Channel, then we'll deal with it. It's supposed oh, yeah. to be raining soon, but I hope this weather holds through next week. You know, 
Midterms. Midterms. Uh, you had to go and bring that up. I don't want to think about it. Ugh. Stinky. I wish I had Yukiko's gift for studying. Hey, Yosuke! Why don't you have Yukiko go over some of the material with you? Hmm? Oh, that's right. Yukiko's ranked at the top on every exam. Maybe I should ask her for some private lessons. Uh, private lessons? Private? Huh? What's wrong? Ow! What was that for? I'm just asking you to help me study. <gasps> oh, I'm sorry. You were talking about studying. I thought it might have been an off-color joke. Arin has had some strange visitors lately. If you thought it was a joke, then just shrug it off. Jesus Christ. Sorry, my hand moved without thinking. Jeez. Okay. Thanks a lot, Chie, for bringing up the whole studying thing. W what did I do? <sighs> You're the one who made it sound creepy and wrong. Private lessons, huh? That's just tutoring. Uh, what? Then it's mostly my fault? Oh, I should start heading home. Yeah, let's just leave them to argue and we can just go home and sleep and be better than them. Class is abandoned for today. You have no choice but to wait for another rainy night. You record talking your phone's home job. Golden week is over. I wanted more time to play. Well, I need to start preparing for my test now. I'll have to find someone who studied all week and copy his notes. Oh yeah. I heard if you do well on the exams, Queen Tut will give you a reward. Is that the teacher? Well, that girl in mind, it's time to give it my all. <laughs> I love this game. It has been um, very, very good so far. I've been having a good, good time. It's high school? It is, yes. Oh my God, it's the Bull Boys. How are we doing, Bull Boys? So why you gotta ask me about finding dates? That's what I wanna know. Uh, sorry about that. Heading <laughs> home, Sharky. Okay? Later, man. Drama? Uh, who are you calling stupid? Oh, it's you. Sorry, I was talking to these morons. On your way home, be careful. <laughs> really? No, you're so stupid, Daisuke. Isn't there anything to do? Every day is the same as the last. Yosuke, I don't know if we can hang out. And I feel bad saying no. I oh the fuck what uh um hi you wanna you wanna join the persona users and get a persona whoa something's here a, a fox when did it the mysterious fox you encountered at the shrine is sitting next to you could I have followed you without you noticing. I think the fox is the murderer. <laughs> Dude, it looks scary too. It's friendly-ish. Oh, this apron. I think I've seen it at the shrine before. You told everyone about your encounter with the mysterious fox. Huh? Curious with leaves? Yeah. The feeling was, oh, I'm so sorry. Have we missed anything important? We have a fox now. Huh? 
cooperative. Yeah, I didn't know. Yeah. Are you serious? So we want money in exchange for fixing us up? It makes that noise. The fox gave out a cry, as if in affirmation. What's with this guy? It acts like it understands what we're talking about. It yipped again. Maybe it really does understand what we're saying. But when you <laughs> think about it, that means the police on duty and whatnot didn't find this fox, right? If it followed after us, then it really is something. Oh my god, the fox hates the police too? You think it really understands us? What should we do? Well, I'd feel bad if we trapped it. It doesn't look like it'll do us any harm. What do you think? <laughs> Let's let it help, I guess. I <laughs> Yeah. And thinking about what happened at the shrine, don't you think this curing would be a big help for us? For sure. Huh? Are you suggesting we take it into that other world? Hmm. Are we gonna put glasses on the fox? <laughs> I guess that might work. It doesn't seem like it's going to leave that easily either. And I definitely don't want it being all sulky and getting up to mischief in the store. The fox looks satisfied. You decide to let the fox do whatever it wants. You should try taking it into the other world. Go on, fox. Jump into the TV. Just jump into the TV. Go on. Go on. Come on. Yeah, let's go. Come into the TV with us, little fox guy. Um. <laughs> Come on, little foxy. Oh, it's Sensei. How can I help out? We have a fox. In the end, he followed you all the way here. It seems to be happy to come along. Even in this strange atmosphere. Huh? What's that weird thing with the red apron? Huh? Sensei's helper? Amazing! Sensei sure knows some neat people. Nice to meet you, Mr. Fox. Let's both do our best. Ow! Pat its head. He seems to be enjoying it. Ow! Oh, thank you. Pretty good deal. Huh. Well, here we are. But is there something we gotta do here? Yes. Shadow time. Hi, Chris. How's it going? Um... There are two enemies! Hang in there! We will. Some thick skin! Oh, the bone. I can't defeat it! Two enemies left! Yeah, I think he should have some... glasses. He deserves them. Oh. Sensei, you knock it down. Um, might as well just do that, I guess. That was a good one, Sensei. <laughs> nice, Chie. Some thick skin. Yuki-chan beat an enemy! Keep going! Ha, I couldn't quite beat it! Just one enemy left! Beautifully done. Uh, that took forever! Yay! I leveled up! I need a little side manga of Mr. Fox and Teddy hanging out the entrance while the party are fighting. Just having a little conversation. Having a little chat. Maybe Mr. Fox thinks that Teddy's like a little chew toy. I mean, what? Hmm. He isn't? That's the right way to think. You're already where you need to be.
Ooh. Hello, hand. I do not care to fight you if you do not. <laughs> <clears throat> oh. There are two enemies. Hang in there. I'll try. Throw down. Damn, it's not going down. Two enemies. Charge through. Them. I couldn't do it. I couldn't quite beat it. Enemy reinforcements. Hurry and beat them. Three enemies left! That's it, Yosuke! One enemy down! Very nice. Someone else's turn. I feel like they block it. I don't remember. Never mind. Good job. Surprisingly profitable. Yo, oh, yeah. No. Someone else's turn. You knocked it down. Good idea, Yuki Chan. Hell yeah, Yuki Chan. Go forward. Amazing moves. God, I love her persona so much. It looks so cool. Oh, Yosuke. An enemy escaped! Just one left for you! Oh, Yosuke. Hey, damn it! Da, 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 da. How was the Persona of the fourth variety? Well, imagine five, but imagine minus one. Fight! So persistent! And then you kind of got it. But no, it's actually pretty good. I've, I may have cried earlier. Um, I, I, it's, I... Have you heard of Nanako? I just love Nanako, AJ. AJ, it's a Nanako. A Nanako as well. Uh, also, I hope you had a good stream. I hope uh, Arcane was beautiful. I already know it was. But... That's some thick skin. Two enemies left. There. I can't defeat it. Yeah, so good. The same Hannah mode. I actually have had to freaking try level up in this game, which hurts me greatly. And I have to buy items. Maybe this is the one game that won't let me Hannah mode it. Who knows? Oh, we got the angel. Amazing, Sensei. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hannah mode finds a way. It almost definitely shall. Um, it does tend to, because I have no say over Hannah mode. It is just um. A force of nature. <laughs> yes. You've already played a dozen games where Hanamo couldn't work and somehow it still worked. Charoo, I guess. We'll see if we can do this. I smell one enemy! You can do it! I hope so. Oh, I tied and go for it! Didn't mean that. I've already messed up. Yeah. You already you had a mode of Kumara, so I am impressed. Thank you. No, Sensei! Sensei, get up! So this one wasn't it. This one wasn't the one. This one. This 
this one, this one wasn't, I didn't know what. Yeah, uh, yeah. Well, let's try that again. You're gonna make a side day here. I'll try I'm my best. Enemy. You can do it. it was. I messed up because you know I did the whole One enemy. Fight. the wrong Fight. button. Fight. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't do it. Honey, we're one hit in. You'll get there. Again. No, Sensei! Sensei, get up! How is this more difficult than it was before I got higher levels? What? Okay, we're never, we're never moving on. I am out. I'm leaving. I'm done. <laughs> what the hell? I don't even know. Hold on, let's, uh... Oh! Welcome wait, to the velvet why is this thing on the floor? Why is Mary, Mary, where is she? What? What's on the floor? Something is different. Marie is nowhere to be found. If you are looking for Marie, I sent her on an errand. She should be back soon. Why did you send her? Oh, please don't be concerned. The er this errand is, of course, pertaining to those of us who reside within the Velvet Room. I would never allow her to roam your wild freely by herself. There's a piece of paper on the floor. Oh. What is that? She must have dropped it. <laughs> it seems the piece of paper belongs to Marie. You notice something written on it. Perhaps you should return it to her. Huh? Wait, no. Marie frantically snatches the paper away from you. Grr, grr. What is this? <laughs> she just starts barking. What are you doing? I mean, what are you doing? Did you look? Show me. Huh? Show you stupid puppet sleaze, but I hate you. W w w why should I show you? This isn't meant for you to see. Marie is blushing furiously. I'm not a stereotype. Just forget this happened. All of it. I'm hypnotizing you now. Sleep, sleep. You didn't see anything. Now wake up. <laughs> that is quite an interesting reaction. Is what is on that paper really that embarrassing? Welcome to the Velvet Room. Excuse us. Now once again, welcome to the Velvet Room. Welcome my butt. That was close. Marie returns to her seat and fidgets relentlessly. Marie, I'm so desperate for you to become more than you are. I... I'm praying. I was about to ask how you felt about her so far. It's just, I don't even talk. And then she's like, oh, it's not like I like you. Oh, you're such a pub. Oh yeah, and I'm like, I didn't say anything. What is going on? <laughs> Which is a bit, it's a bit, um, it's a bit much. It's, she's, um, yes. Um... 
yeah. Oh, oops. Um. She's very anime girl. It's very like the stereotype of it. I want it to change, <laughs> but <laughs> that would be nice. Hilda vibes? Oh my god, no. Don't insult Hilda this way. What the hell? Hilda is an angel. Maria's not. Beautiful. Justice for Hilda. <laughs> Hilda is very lovable. Thank you for the follow. That's a justice one for my main girl, Nanako. Perfect. Um, I mean, I still feel like we're gonna lose. But then does that mean I should level up more? Do more fights? Maybe we should do some more. To be honest, that's fine. Down, 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 I don't. How do I? You're level 16? But even you're not doing well. This is terrible. This is very bad. Um. We're not gonna fight it though. We're gonna go this way. <laughs> We're gonna do some fights away from it, I think. Uh, I think that's for the best. Unfortunately. The grind is real. Sadly. That was pretty cool though. There are two enemies. Hang in there. <laughs> Two enemies left. Throw down. Persona. That's okay. Nice. Watch me. Beautiful lads. Let's go run. Yo. That was incredible. You're all the best. I hope you know that. And we got some moustache fibers. Wow, I'm really living the life. Mm. You'll come back better than ever. Hell yeah. I'll be so strong. I'm scared of you, so we're gonna kill you. Cause I need to not be fearful. I need to be brave. I, three enemies. Don't get I need to grow. Yes. It was a cakewalk. Sadly not. Someone else's turn. Um. I am now. It's not Three enemies left. I think I've done that like five times and I'm so sorry, Yukiko. It's genuinely not your fault. I just am a fool. Come on. Yes. 
I do harbor in the joke classes. She loved it so much I could not not have her have it. Great sensei! Hey! Hell yeah. Good work, Sensei! Yeah. That's one so far! Speed running? Easy. Oh. Hello. Oh, reinforcements are here. Smash them. Great, Sensei. Go for gross. What is happening? Beautifully done. We won. <laughs> Just adjust the glasses. Looking pretty cool. Strat. I'm. I'm just saying, maybe if we get a good... Oh, I need to time it better. Um, if we get lucky... Assuming the... Oh, sorry, I'm Yosuke. Assuming the little guys are the same as the big guys. It's... Too enemies left! Go, Sensei! Nice you partner. knocked it down! <laughs> it's down! Let's ready! Let's go! Couldn't quite beat it. Chie, now's our chance! Alright! This is it! <laughs> Good job. Very impressed. Nice. That's what we like to see, Chie. Let's go, lesbians. Yo, ye. Did Hannah? No. Kringle lives on. There are two enemies. Hang he has there. killed me very much, <laughs> very quickly. Go, Sensei! You knocked it down. But we have a maybe strat. There's potentially a strat we could use. It's weakness. We have a potentially. Beat it. I'm with you, Ladies, you're incredible. Be gone. Uh, ooh, I like the look of this one. Hmm. We should probably go for this though. Oh, never mind. I get more because of thingy. I forgot. This one. Sick. Ha -ha, level up. <gasps> it could be Picasso's cousin. Yukiko does have the gag glasses on. She was so happy about them that I literally can't like, as soon as um, Teddy gave them to me, I was like, there's no way I can't give them to her. She freaking adores them. I have to have her with them. Hey, it's gonna. What's up? There are three enemies. Careful! I know the last scene is so cute because it's just like, oh, she was so. Enemies left. Ups, like, right, like so rightfully upset and Someone else is uh, down on everything. So it's just so nice and she's like, just like chill and it would feel okay and just have a giggle and I just ah. It's down! Nice! Oh my god, I love it when he says Adagal. 
for you, okay? Beautiful! Good job! I would be so pissed if my teammate ran up to kick a non-moving target and missed twice. They're trying their best, you know. It's, I gotta tell myself that. They're trying. Also, hi, Gritty. I hope you're good. Injury or luck. Dum ba dum ba dum. I'm down with that. Nice. Perfect. Right. Sensei, are you okay? You're he I'm I'm a little ouchy. Everything hurts quite a lot. That's fine. It's fine. We're gonna quickly do a little heal on everyone. Then somehow we're gonna get back. We're gonna this is probably a waste, but that's fine. Because uh, I'm a little scared. Hello, Fox. Oh my god, I could have just talked to the Fox. Can we have healing? You are a ripoff, Mr. Fox. Bro, You, uh, I am not giving you that much money. You're out of control! You need lower prices! Have you not seen how low the pound has gotten? Bro! I'm not cut out for this life, foxy guy! Jesus! My lord! He's chasing the bike! He needs to calm down! He needs to run a little slower! Warm me up before he friggin' just robs me blind. I I Good. Right. We're gonna win. We're gonna win. We're gonna manifest winning. Counting on you. One enemy! Fight! 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 Persona. It's he's gonna be weak to this, and I'm gonna win. And I'm gonna win. How are the mini versions of you weak to it, but then you're not? They're, they're just stupid. We're gonna die. 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 Get Pringled. <laughs> His name is Contrarian King. Oh. Ah! GH Hunt's hurt. Someone help her. I'm hot. The game hurt me in the in the real world. Persona. It's not working. What is this? I don't know. Persona. Nice. <laughs> Oh, 
god, I don't know. Hey! Okay, 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 okay! There's hope. There is no hope. There is no hope in the world. There is none. Zero. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, it's not the right one. I sent some off-stream grinding. I don't know what you mean. I don't know what you mean. It's gonna be fine. I mean, if it just like focuses... Ha. Thank you. Then we can just slowly do this. Very slowly. Like, so slowly. Like, agonizingly slowly. <laughs> this works for me. I'm down. I mean, if he attacks, um... What is going on? It's going to be slow and steady, but it's going to result in a beautiful win. Maybe. I'm not going to complain. Um... Real dead. What? Sensei! Sensei, get up! <laughs> A hug. That's fine. Okay, it's not time. 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 <laughs> Get me out of here. <laughs> Get me out. Um, I would like to return and then we'll just start. Well, we saved. I think that is better. Is there a good intro again? <laughs> This is a piece for my poor brain. Have you watched the OG one? Yes. I don't remember it, but I think I watched it. <laughs> Mr. Pringles can't hurt us if we're jamming. I am getting super. Oh my God, we've already been streaming for four hours. Oh. Oh. I was about to say, I'm getting very hungry. Time flies and you're having fun, true. The four stands for Persona 4, the actual hour is two. I've only been streaming two hours. I love Kingdom Hearts. Makes sense, makes sense. Hot studs, hot studs. You're back. Hello. You're back. 
Hey, Shawake. Hello, okay. things. You should be used to life here by now. End the conversation? No. <laughs> you bored? Well, have a seat. Oh! Huh? Oh, I think I mean. Social link? Oh, maybe not. We haven't had time to talk like this since you got here, huh? Jima is desperately casting about for their topic to discuss. Um, well, how's school? Um, it's fun. The teachers are insane. That's good to hear. Your school days will be over before you know it. Make sure you have fun while you can. Jima is nodding to himself. What else? Oh, yeah, how about your friends? Look at his face. My guy is trying so hard. He is putting every inch of energy he has into this conversation. It looks like you've already made plenty of them. Tajima is scowling. Oh, maybe he hates my friends. Um, that time on your stream you played other Persona games? I'm not fully sure what you're asking, but I played Persona 5 Royal on stream as well. Uh, I'm not saying who you can and can't hang out with, but you know what I'm talking about, right? N no. What are you saying? Say it. Straight. I don't have enough courage. You know what I'm talking about, right? No. Are you being straight with me? <sighs> well, I'm dating Yosuke, if that's what you mean. I can't tell if you're playing dumb or if you really are that dense. What are you- what are you talk- what's the conversation? For some reason, wherever there's an incident, there you are. I wish I didn't have to consider this, but... The killings began around the time you came to town?! Bro! Dojima! Bro! My job is all about eliminating the random element. I look only at the facts. If you keep getting caught in my job, then... What's wrong? Nanako, your dad is accusing me of murder. They probably didn't do anything bad. Uh, uh, I, I know, I didn't mean it like that. How did you mean it, Dojima? But you're bullying him. I'm not bullying him, we're just having a little talk. It's getting late. <laughs> Go to sleep. Okay. <sighs> Jeez. She's really taking a shine to you. Look, just uh, don't get yourself involved in anything dangerous. As long as you're safe, everything's fine. The parents didn't ask me to raise your grades or anything. It seems Jima is genuinely worried about you. You feel a faint bond. Yes! Yes! We're bonded, Dad. Sorry, you are my dad now. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Oh, you're a hierophant too? So Jiro was as well, right? The papas? They are all the hierophants? Ryotaro Dejima. Nice. Bow, 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 bow. Things here might be a little different from what you're used to, but this is a good town. Though it's a little dangerous right at the moment. Now then, it's about time for you to turn in. Get some sleep. Night. Good night. I really like you, Dejima, and I want you to stop saying doing things that are bad. <laughs> Can you not accuse me of murder? Please? It doesn't make me feel very pog. <laughs> you have a student stalking. All this rain. I hate rain. It's supposed to keep raining until this evening, too. Speaking of misery, midterms start next Monday. They even post the results up for everyone to see. Oh, don't worry about it. Your life isn't going to be ruined by one little piece of paper, is it? What? How can you possibly believe that? Getting good grades has benefits when interacting with people. Talented people really are more highly valued in society. <laughs> Okay, that was a fun conversation to have early in the morning. Oh, you freak. Mr. Hosoi, have you picked up the latest edition of Bully Teacher yet? 
Oh, of course I did, but it's raining today. I hope I can get it home without getting it all wet. So uh, does anyone have an extra book cover they'd be kind enough to lend me? Whoops, I have to start the lecture. Don't try to distract me by talking about books. Today we're going to discuss Kokoro by Sosuke Natsume. Open your textbooks. Before we get to the actual literature, I'll ask a question about Sosuke himself. Hmm, how about Crime Boy Chan, the city boy? What's up? Do you do you know how Sasuke Natsume translated the English phrase I love you? All of the I all of the answers are in English. What? I love you. He translated into I love you. I could die. I love thee. The moon is beautiful. Choosing I love you feels a little too obvious. the last one. We'll go with that. I'll risk it. Oh, you're very knowledgeable. Yeah. 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 He translated as the moon is beautiful, isn't it? By the way, the person who translated it as I could die was Shime Futaba... Futaba... Fu, to Futabate. That's probably awful pronunciation. Another prominent major era writer. Though he translated it from Russian, not English, it's still similar in that they didn't do direct translations. Back then in Japan, there wasn't the same direct expression of love that we have now, so they had to get creative. It's a subtle, endearing translation, much like the Japanese language itself. Anyway, let's get back into Kokoro. Yay. This reference in the silent voice. I have seen that film and um, I have no memory at all. <laughs> hey, Chie. I bought you a new copy of that Trial of the Dragon flick. Yay! It was the greatest punches version for 980 yen. If I knew then, I'd just replaced it instead of buying you grilled steak. Ooh, the vibe! You're really getting closer. Huh? What are you, scared of a little lightning? Quiet, you! I'd be a goner if even one of those things hit me. <laughs> You're freaking out way too much. Come on, shouldn't weather like this help with your kung fu training? A bolt of lightning would hit and it'd give you the inspiration for a new move. There was a scene like that in your DVD, wasn't there? You jerk! You don't even care how I feel! If lightning has to strike someone, let it be this guy! Oh, huh? the lights are gone this out. This is the blackout? This is the best vibes ever! That's what you get for saying that stuff, Chia. Looks like I better hurry up and head to work. Depending Yosuke. on how produce sells today, I might get a little bonus in my pay for the week. That seems so unsafe, so my guy. Keep customers away, but I gotta do my best if I'm gonna save up for a motorcycle. Uh? It's from my manager. Hello? Uh, Yosuke-kun? Hmm. Uh, some of the power in the store is out after that lightning strike. C could you come in early today? All the refrigerated shelves have stopped running. It's looking like we'll have to close up the produce section early today. Wait, what? But my pay! Anyway, I need you here to help deal with this mess. I'm counting on you! Goodbye! Wait! Retail's the worst, Yosuke. I'm so sorry. What are you looking at me for? Uh, why did this have to happen? Hey, Yukiko! Can we just go home? Chie, do you know this story? 
a girl forgot her homework, so she snuck into school in the middle of the night, but she suddenly needed to use the bathroom. She ventured into the girl's room where all the lights were off. No one should have been there, but in the mirror... Hold it right there! What are you talking about? <laughs> it's a ghost story. I thought you liked them. Yeah, but why tell it now? Because it's the perfect time! She is on the verge of tears. What should you do? Make her cry. <laughs> Lightly touch, she is back. <laughs> oh, man. Ooh. Someone's here! It touched me! It, it's a ghost! Wait, was that you? Sheesh! You suck! Uh, why don't you just have him escort you back home, Gia? Uh, are you making fun of me? <laughs> well, yeah, with how freaked out you are, can you blame me? Yay! Uh, the power's back! Come on, Yukiko, let's go home! Wow. Chan, you can go leave in a hurry. Classes have ended for today. You have no choice but to wait for another rainy night. Ah, the beautiful vibes. Oh, wait, I have something for you. The rain isn't stopping at all. What if the Samagawa further overflows? I'm worried. I have the angel one. Wow, thank you so much. Here, this is my uh, key, as uh, thanks. Thank you. They're pretty, so I, I kept them as lucky chums, but uh, boys don't need things like that, do they? But, but I need to give you something to pay you back, so please keep them. It's true. Boys, we don't need luck. We're, the, we're lads. What is a lucky charm to a lad? Uh-huh. Yo, Shuake, don't you start to feel a little sluggish before tests? It's not like people in sports bother to study anyway. Yo. Hey, Shabake. Not much to do before the test without practice, huh? Hello, I have a statue for you as well. Ugh, incredible. <laughs> How spectacular! I can feel the palpitation of my heart! I'm so excited, I could trace the mystic hex around you and enter you into a contract with the great unknown. <clears throat> Excuse me, um, here is the reward just as promised. Thank you. That's very kind of you, you strange, strange, strange man. <gasps> yes. Um. Oh, the rain and the thunder, it's so good. The vibes are so magnificent. It's so perfect. I love this. It's, oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, 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 wow. We also need to go watch the TV, but I don't know if there's something we can efficiently do before we watch the TV. I do wish there was some music. <gasps> yeah, when it's like several days in a row, I kind of get you. But I kind of like this. I gotta say. I didn't think I'd rain this badly. My leather shoes are gonna be ruined. The canal is roaring. Yep, this is the countryside. Oh, buddy. Oh, pal. Oh, we can eat some ramen. That'll be smart. Oh, can I afford ramen? I like it without music. I, I, I kind of agree because at least with a lot of the music, my brain can just be very easily overwhelmed if there's like constant, constant lots of noise, I guess. So I don't mind it. Like when it's a few days in a row with no music, then I start to miss it. But I don't mind it. Don't worry, bud, you'll get that one day. Your personality has grown tremendously. I'm so proud. I heard about you from my daughter. So you're a transfer student? My daughter said you're cool. Her name is Aika. Unfortunately, she's out right now on a delivery. I'm cool. Yeah. Hi, Nanako. I didn't bring you any ramen. Welcome home. Could be a lot on the brain. Yeah, exactly. 
It's still raining, but the thunder was loud. Please, Gab, big bro. So we can't. Oh, well, but we can hang out with my my angel. Hello. Um. Yes. Annika looks as if she's not doing anything. Since you have Archangel, Persona of the Justice Arcana, you might. You two might have gone along well. Yes. What's up, Nanako? Yay! Oh, um. Big bro. Nanako's fidgeting. Go ahead and ask. Yeah. Okay. Um, well. Are you an only child? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're just like me. Oh, but I have you now, so... A while ago, Daddy told me that our family won't get any bigger. <laughs> but now I have a big brother! Nanako beams at you with a smile that covers her entire face. Through that smile, through that smile you feel your relationship has grown deeper. I adore Nanako. She is just the most angel. Oh my god. Oh. Hey Mike, it's good, thank you. Your power to create personas of the justice all kind of grown. Let's talk, Big Bro. Um, I want to hear about your school. Nanako has begged you to talk to her. You decided to talk about various things. Complaints so you put Nanako to bed. We tucked her in, we made sure she was all comfy and had her teddy to not teddy teddy but her, her teddy to hang to cuddle and then no. of course a bedtime story. Oh hello, it's me, Chie. Hi Chie. And you mind hanging out with me for a while today? I need to get my mind off of studying for a bit. For you, G? Yeah! <laughs> Great, see you soon. Hmm. This looks like a good spot. <laughs> you know, for training. I need to hone my kicking skills or I won't be able to use them in battle. <laughs> I tried practicing at home, but my mom and dad yelled at me for putting a hole in the shirt. <laughs> Still, now's the time to train, right? Right? Yeah. You think so too? She looks really happy. So let's train together. Are you gonna kick me? No. I'm cool with that. Right. Thanks, Shwaki Ken. Easy. The thing, you know, from that time. I mean, the shadow that came out of me. I feel pathetic knowing that's another me. Makes me feel like I gotta work harder. All right. Let's do it. Between you and me, we'll be unstoppable. This marks the beginning of your training with Chie. You feel your relationship with Chie has grown a bit deeper. Oh yeah. Boom, we're speeding through ranks. <laughs> Ooh! That's cool. Let's start today with frog leaps. Come on, you try some. Be the frog. Laters! You turn with Chia for a while and walked partway home with her. Hello. What's up? Nanako seems to be lost in thought. Uh, ask her what's wrong. Um, well... Nanako fidgets. I made flowers at school yesterday. They said today is Mother's Day. My teacher told us that's a day when you give your mom flowers. I don't have a mom, so I don't know what to do with these flowers. Nanako seems upset. Um, 
Oh, I want to choose you can give them to her, but I don't know if there's like a grave or anything. But that's what I want to do. Because then, I, or I would say give them to your dad, but he's often not home. So... Give them to Yosuke and myself, because we are your fathers now. Um, I'm fine, I just spilled water all over my face. I don't want to say give them to me, I don't know. Maybe she would like that, but... I'd rather she give them to her dad. Um... Because, like, I feel like uh, Dejima is more like... Um... Uh, I don't know. Uh, just the whole, like, Mother's Day, I feel like it being a parental role. And I don't think I'm a parental role. I'm just a bro. I'm just... Yeah. I guess she does consider me family, though. Oh, I'm really overthinking this. Um... I'm go we'll go with you can give them to her, and if worse comes to worse, I will literally reload just for a better thing. Huh? Oh, you mean the family altar? Yeah. Dad always puts food there. He said it gets to Mom in heaven. Yeah. Do you think my flowers will get to her too? Exactly. Absolutely. I did a really good job on mine. My teacher said they were pretty too. I wonder if my mom will be happy to get them. Of course she will. Are you kidding? They're beautiful. You should make a flower too, big bro. Then we can celebrate Mother's Day together. Oh my god. Nanako thought you had to make an origami flower. We did it! Oh, you place the finished flower on the family altar. It's getting late, so you put Nanako to bed and head back to your room. <laughs> oh my god. Uh. I don't know. I just, I love that she's so, like, it's so heartbreaking because she's so mature. But then, um, and she doesn't need to be as mature as she is, but because she is that mature, she's so good at looking out and like wanting other people to join in. And I just feel like it's because she's so lonely. Oh God. And she's like so lonely and she doesn't actually like anyone being left out at all. So like when Yosuke and the two girls are like, yeah, let's go get uh, Nanako stuff. She's like, oh, do you want anything big bro? And, you know. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Your first time uh, mid-times will come today and just continue through Thursday. You should already to school. Man, I'm just begging for a save point. <laughs> oh. hmm. Morning. Exams are finally starting today. Real life's harsh. Have you learned to pick your battles? <laughs> Can you tell? Can you tell? Do I look like I'm ready? But even once exams are over, we're not done with the case. All this depressing stuff's gonna just gonna keep going on and on and on. Her writing is so good. I think like kid characters can be really hit and miss for me, but like Nanako's is just like pure hit. I don't know if it's because like I relate to some aspects of her character quite a lot. Um, I like, I understand her like childhood feeling and that sort of vibe. Um, not to the same extent, but I guess that's part of it. But like kid characters can definitely be hit or miss. So I get that. What is it called when muscles grow after exercise? Over... Fuck! 
over. That was truly cringeworthy. Thank you. <laughs> Good night. Thanks for stream. Thank you so much for the 300 biddies. Good night. I hope you sleep super well. Thank you so much for hanging out. Um, I just love seeing how kids see the world in such a different POV. The world is so small to them, so everything is really big. I love that same pinky. Absolutely same. Um, and it's weird. Like I, uh, I'd love to see like Spy Family is coming back this weekend or next weekend or something. Um, and it has a really cool kid character in it, and I love that. That's a lot of her. Um, in that anime as well. I love that sort of. It's such an interesting way to view stuff. Um, thank you for the hind dream. I don't remember. Over exhaustion, maybe. <laughs> Frick. Whew. I got one right. <laughs> Out of the two questions on my midterms, I got at least half. I think it was marriage. Doing good. I'm gonna be so popular. I'm gonna be so cool and so popular. <laughs> um, oh, Pythagoras said that. Oh, I don't remember this one. Never mind. Yeah, I do. Boom. Bam. Pew. Now I guess the is Anna. That's wild. Cause I, I Anna's voice is like I I it wasn't my favorite voice, but Nanako's voice is so cute. You feel you did well? I feel I did great. I only got one question wrong. Pretty good if I do say so myself. It's finally over. Ooh, what a load off. I bet every student feels like this after exams are over. Hey, quiet down! So what did you write for number seven? <laughs> the one about what that referred to in the sentence? Um, I put her sorrow- Assassin in Phase Zero? That's cool. I did watch the Phase Zero dubbed. Oh crap, then I got it wrong! I put the rice cakes on top of the table! Rice cakes? <gasps> Wait, was that what the story was about? All right, I'm giving up on composition. I'm gonna bet it all on geography. What did you choose for the tallest mountain in the solar system? The Olympus one. Ah, seriously? <laughs> I chose the wrong one. Oh, I put that one too. Whoa, you two? And it's probably the right answer. <sighs> Boy, I can't wait for our grades to be posted. <laughs> Me neither. One can see him. It's gonna be great. Jeez. Hey, did you hear? A TV station's filming here in town. Oh. They're probably just doing more stuff about that hanging corpse case. No, it's not that. You know the highway nearby? They're gonna cover those biker gangs that hang around there. A friend of mine goes to the biker meeting sometimes. I heard it from him. Dude. What are you doing hanging out with a guy in a biker gang? Well, anyways, what do you think about tomorrow's group blind date? We were gonna meet outside, but it's gonna rain soon, right? Group blind date. Wouldn't it be better group blind date. To tomorrow, too? Let's go. Biker gang? Oh, biker gang, yeah. Oh, yeah. They raise a ruckus from time to time. I guess your place is too far away to hear them. We live right by the road. The noise can drive you insane. I hear some guys at this school are part of it, too. Yeah, I know there are some rumors about a first-year student here who's a total hellraiser. One of the guys working at Jeunesse said the dude's been a legend ever since middle school. Although, was he in a biker gang? Did... 
Did you say he was a legend? <laughs> Since uh, middle school. <laughs> what? Who is this child? I know, I want Mondo. Mondo or water. Uh, okay, we're gonna end there. Bring me Keith Silverstein. Bring me Mondo Awada. My favorite biker gang boy. He makes me so miserable. Not Keith, yes, more Keith. I will Keith in everything, please. Keith is so good. I'm watching uh, Devil Man Cry Baby and Keith like plays so many people and every time I'm like, hey, it's Keith. Hey, it's Keith. Oh, that's Keith. Cool, Keith. Hey, Keith. <laughs> it's great. Um, thank you all so much for hanging out. I need food so desperately. My tummy is screaming at me. Um, thank you so much for hanging out. Please feel free to join the Discord if you're newer here. We have a whole stream spoiler section where you can talk about Persona 4 as much as you want. And when I say that girl that runs the beef steak shop uh, is the murderer, you can go into the spoiler channel and go, oh my god, Hannah got it right already? Because it's definitely her. I believe in it. I, yep. Um, also there's other cool channels like a Final Fantasy XIV channel and Genshin channel and a whole bunch. Um, so yeah. I just love that you always play my favorite games, Hannah. First Final Fantasy XV, now Persona Golden, so nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Um, I'm glad I get to experience them for the first time. Um, they're so beautiful. I've been thinking about XV a lot recently, so oh, yes. Um, and then obviously you can follow on social media if you would like to. Um, but that's it for me today. I'll be back again tomorrow for some more hangouts and um, biker gangs. Hopefully. Bye!